Alright, cut this going. Where's my chat? Why won't it show? Where's my chat? My chat! There we go. I wonder if that's going to block anything. I guess we'll see. Du, 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 du. I think I got everything up and going right. Let's uh, see what's we got here. Hopefully people actually show up because I told them to be here. All right, well, let's see if it, let's see if I can put chat on this one. I don't know if I can. I don't know if I have the room on the screen because there's so many stats you have to look at and everything. I like, I like having a replay. Hey, <sighs> caramba, I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm chilly too. Hopefully this one doesn't crash on me. It, it, it didn't crash so far when I was playing it, but. Hopefully this one doesn't crash on me like Amnesia freaking did. Why does it take so damn long to load? Oh my goodness. What is this thing? I can't read. Hang on. Oh, buenas. Buenos dias, muchacho. See, I don't think I need... As long as I can see one, I'm good. Why can't I minimize this, though? That sucks. I'm trying to minimize my chat so I can see... Please don't tell me the game crashed, dude. Dude! No! Respond! <laughs> dude! Respond! Dude, like, the games crash every single time I load up a game, like, as of... Man... Like, yeah, like today, I guess, uh, it keeps freaking crashing. Like, I'll go white screen for a little bit. I hope it doesn't, because I don't want to have to recreate my characters again. I did, like, a whole family, like, a whole little clan of, like, uh, brothers and sisters. And I don't want to have to make them again. No, you're gonna respond! You have to respond! What's the title? What's the title in this stream? Is it showing up as Going Medieval or is it showing up as Cajun Chef still? It's not supposed to be Cajun Chef. I don't know why it's still showing up like that. <laughs> like it's supposed to be Going Medieval. Oh my god. I'm gonna- I'm gonna- oh my god. I'm gonna throw myself off a bridge. Hang on. I have to restart the game. Oh my god. Are you serious? This is so annoying. And I really, like, I don't know if it's my computer. Or if it's the the games. Like, I really don't know. See, I have to freaking start the game back up. Oh, man. I need to finish my Blasphemous playthrough. That's right. I ran out of videos from yesterday for my uh, scheduled uploads. Come on, dude. Eat my butt. Come on. Freaking load. I told everybody I was going to be streaming today. Are you going to load? Which one are you going to load? 3.30 at 10 a.m. No! This is my old games. Damn it. Okay. Well, I guess I'll have to just set it up again, which is whatever. I saved two of the... Two of the... Uh, I saved two of the siblings to begin with. It saved my crest. I want to do the mountain, and then, uh, well, oh, there's two mountains. No, there's not. I want to try the mountains, though. With a large map. And then... Um... Where's my... Ah, uh, where? Wait. Oh, wait, hang on. How do I get my, um... Wait. Oh, no! I well I saved I saved everything for a freaking reason in case it's in case it crashed. And so that I wouldn't have to Oh my god. Wait, no, no, no. How do I Where's my phone? 
No, I'm not I'm not doing this again. <laughs> Where are my presets? Where are my presets? Load, there we go. Yeah. Carta. I had Carta. Finala. And then I had another one. I had I had the little brother. I'm gonna remake the little brother real quick. His name was um these are the wolf siblings. It's kind of based on like a Norwegian or like mythology or uh like like the Vikings or whatever. His name was um Garth. And he looked like this kind of He was like the shorter brother. He had like kind of brown hair, something like this. No, not like that. What was his what kind, of, what kind of facial hair did I have for him? It was something like this. He had like a mustache. Not a porn stash, just a mustache, like a full mustache. Um, and he was sure what, what was that one? Uh the fool. I'm just kidding when he was uh, Yeah, that's just essentially what I wanted him to be. And he was 22 years old. Are their ages right and everything? Their weights? Yeah. Okay. He was 22. I don't think I assigned them religious alignment. Alright. So he was kind of short. Not shorter than his sister. But like kind of short. He was like that, and I had him a skinny fella. Carta was also not super super big. I should have just saved all of them, but I didn't think it would crash. So, um, so yeah, I had him on like, are their skills set as well? Yes, they are. Okay, so I just need to reset his skills. This was like low. This was kind of high. This was whatever. I don't really care. I'm not too... whatever. I mostly wanted a big brother and a sister, but... Kartha has... I'm gonna have to give Kartha more marksmen. Um... Finala... Yeah, and then Garth. Makes me want to do a story with them. I think it'd be fun. <laughs> he was gonna be like the softer, younger brother. Like... The one who, like, is better at, like, working with his hands with, like, small stuff and he was gonna be, like, not super smart. But he's good at, like, cooking and, and planting and tailoring and all that stuff. Stuff like that. Yeah. I think that looks good. Don't crash on me this time. God. <laughs> I know it's probably not the best weekend to be streaming considering it's Easter weekend and everybody's probably like out with their, you know, with their families and um, doing other stuff. But I wanted to stream again because it's been a minute since I streamed and it does good for the channel. So I'm feeling a little lonely lately. I feel like I want to talk to my peeps on YouTube and, and whatnot. There's like 22 people who follow me on Twitch. I don't even know why. Like, I guess because like... I restream there, um, but yeah, <laughs> I mostly focus like everything on YouTube. So I wonder if I should try Facebook streaming. I know there's a couple of big YouTubers who do Facebook streaming as well, and I wonder how well that works for them. I'm not sure though. Dude, come on. Do not crash. Why would it be crashing so much? It didn't crash on the uh, original one I played with the, the, the lone survivor. Dude. Oh my god. Every time I want to stream, the, the games don't want The games just don't want to cooperate. I'm so sorry if you joined just now to see this 
freaking stream like crash but my games don't want to ever work when i stream and i'm about to look this up because this game has a lot of bugs it's still too new I don't want to update my drivers. I want to stream. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, oh, is it working? Oh my God, it worked. Okay, <laughs> huzzah. Okay. The plague had ravaged the British Isles, leaving a trail of destruction in its way. Untold millions went into an early grave and those left standing were plunged into poverty, brutally scarred by the horrors they had witnessed. Nothing would ever be the same, the same again. In the springtime of the year of 15... Uh, 1353, Cartha, Fenella, and Garth set off into the wilderness to claim a piece of land as their own, as was their right, and the eyes of God and under the law. Here they may lay down the foundations for some kind of future. Perhaps hope will follow. Fenella is confident, defiant even. We will make this work. We will take our share of land and we will build there and defend it. Blah, blah, blah. I've read all this already. After walking for an eternity, the pure, swift-running streams of clean air and mountain ridge stole Garth's breath away. And just beneath the surf, just beneath the surface, mineral. Good lord, I almost said millennials. Minerals glimmered, rich with promise. The travelers knew that this was the place they had been searching for. They decided to call it Wolfwood. I hope I'm not like stupid for saying this is kind of like Norwegian. It's like Viking. I, I want this this family to be Viking inspired. And like canonically, I don't think you can make siblings, but they're siblings. They're all brothers and sisters. Kartha is the oldest. Garth is the second youngest, and then Fenala is the oldest. And, uh, yeah. So let's get all this not forbidden. I wanna- I wanna be able to use all this. Ooh! We have a chronicle pile. Perfect. I need that. And we've got beer! Woo! <laughs> That's exactly- that's all we need to survive out here. A couple of vikings out in the mountains, all we need is some alcohol and- and a- and a, and a fighting spirit. Oh, and we brought a cat with us! Last time I had a dog. And his name was- I didn't name him, but it- it automatically named him Braxton or something like that. It was kind of stupid, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but- Alright, so we got a bunch of hay, we got all this stuff. Yeah, can I like mass- mass forbid and mass allow? Yeah, I want to, like, do that. I want to select it. And, uh... Yay, beer! Yeah, for real. I'll give you some on this beautiful Saturday that I spent the entire day indoors on. <laughs> Choose the... Di okay, so I know how to stockpile. So, forbidden somehow, you can allow forbidden by them to select the art and select the act. Yeah, I know. I want to, like, mass. There we go. Make that a little bit faster. Alright, so Kartha is our big brother and he is, you know, like the archer and is that a long bow? I feel like a short bow is but short bows are better for hunting, right? So I'm gonna give him the short bow. I don't think I gave any of the other siblings like fighting abilities. Garth is more with his hands, Fenala is more like a the animal and other stuff uh kind of sibling. But, okay, so I want to build our house on the rock because I want to save, I want to save, um, what do you call it? Like, I want to, I want to save the, the fertile land for, for farming, which we are in the mountain, but still. What's a dumping stockpile? Oh, waste. Okay. Um, so let's make a, like, tiny little stockpile right here. We're going to do it in the trees. And then I'm going to have, um, I don't really know anything with the, like, animal husbandry right now. So I'm going to have Fenala chop all these trees. Can I assign it to her? I want her to, I want her to do it. Or Kartha, whatever. Yeah, you're the big strong brother. You can do whatever the hell you want, I guess, <laughs> with all the manual labor. 
guys, please let me know. Is it what is it showing up? What is the title showing up as? Is it showing up as Cajun Chef, or is it showing up as Going Medieval? Because it's supposed to be Going Medieval. In my restream chat app, I have Chef. In my Opera GX browser, I have um, Going Medieval. So I just want to make sure that people are getting what they're coming for. Um, but yeah, let's see. So everybody's chopping trees. It's cool. We got a whole little team now. See, the first time I was playing alone because I wanted to just like take my time and learn. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to like get used to the game. But now that we've got all these kids running around doing it for me, we can just have them all work a little bit faster. Let's just chop a, a crap ton of trees because I need, we're going to need a lot of wood. Because we're going to have to build them beds and like a decently sized home. And then I need to be able to stockpile um, food inside. Because that was a mistake I had made when I was learning was that I let food just sit in the outside stockpile. And wolves and uh, whatever those other little things are kept coming to eat my food. There's really nothing important, like, on this side right here, so the, the chat's not really blocking anything, but I like to have chat documented, like, in the stream if I can, so. Which I really don't like the restream chat. Um, when I get paid, maybe not this time around, but the next time I get paid, I'm gonna probably invest in stream labs. Is that what it is? There's the- whatever the other one is, where you can, like, go in and, and edit, um, and stream to multiple places. I'm pretty sure it's Streamlabs. I can't remember. But yeah, I'm gonna go invest in it and um, try to make my streams a little bit more aesthetically pleasing and, uh, you know, run a little smoother, I guess. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna have everybody chop a bunch of trays. And then I think we should stockpile specifics. So where's that one that I made? That's right here. I wanted it specifically for wood, but I guess we can... I guess we can just make another. So I'll make a one. I'll make another stockpile. This will on this kind of rocky terrain here. We're just gonna have like a big. We're in the mountains, so we're gonna need like a really big stockpile. So this uh, you gotta do clear all material. Um, hang on, raw material. We're just gonna do one big wood stockpile. That way they put all the wood right there. And we can save up for the winter. Yeah, it is pretty neat. I do like this game. I love Colony Builder Sims. And this one just feels like a lot more involved. Um, the aesthetics are like not my favorite, but they're good. It runs good, um, which I used to get a lot of lag on uh, a lot of Colony Builders. But um, I recently beat Frostpunk, uh, not on the channel, like, yeah, it, it barely ran on my computer, so I probably couldn't even film it. it. OBS would probably make my entire computer crash with it. But I played some uh, Frostpunk, and I actually really, really enjoyed it. But I like how this is more, like, settler-focused than, um, like, building-focused. Like, it's, it's from the ground up. There's no real, like, presets or anything. Like, you just make it happen and I, that's what i like about this game that's what enticed me about it so i'm just gonna have all my kids bringing that in actually you know what garth no 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 not garth kartha kartha is gonna go hunting because we need we need a food i don't want to slaughter the lambs because we might be able to oh there's a deer carcass over here Ooh, Kartha, go get that. Kartha, where are you? Go get that. Yeah, grab that. No, it's like free food. I love the concept from building from nothing. I know, me too. Like, I love the idea of like creating from scratch, which is one of the reasons why this game caught my eye. Okay, so I, we need to make a, a stockpile. So actually, I guess maybe it would be good to take this opportunity okay so this is kind of where it wants us so we're gonna build would you cooperate <laughs> okay so we're gonna have 
I'm gonna build kind of like this. Wait, can't place this from far from a stable structure. Wait, oh no, that's not what I wanted. No, delete that. No, no, no. I don't want it up. I want it on the back. I'm gonna. This is gonna be like the food room. This is, this is gonna be like the food room. Most people usually call those kitchens, but I'm just. This is gonna be the food room. This is where we're gonna stockpile our food. And hang on, I'm not done. We're gonna have like a little food stockpile room. Sorry, somebody's somebody's messaging me on on a work chat. Um, but yeah, okay. So this will be like our little food room in the back, and then we'll make like a, a main room on each side. Uh, I don't want that wall there. I wish there was a quicker way to to get rid of it, but. I don't want that deer carcass to go to waste because we could most certainly use that. I I told you to freaking to, there. <laughs> um. So let's see, and then we'll we'll just make like a, a big front room, I guess. They're all siblings. I'll just make them all sleep in the same room. The reason I'm doing it like this though is because there's kind of like. Um, this weird, I guess I can just build a door. We'll do like a double door to make it like a little bit more somewhat, uh, symmetrical. But the reason that I'm doing it like this is because I've noticed, I don't know if it's a bug, but there seems to be an issue in the game where you don't, they don't build the roof properly. Like it doesn't, it doesn't lay right. So we'll try, but this is what I want to do. Kind of like, um, we'll just do a thatched roof. Yeah, it's kind of dinky a little bit. It's good. It's just the building system is like really particular. So we'll have this. Do you see what I mean? It's like it needs specific points. And I don't know if this is like too big. Can I only build so, can I only build so wide? Is that why? I don't know. It doesn't really explain why things don't work. If I have a different... If I have a different material, can I build a bigger roof? See, this is what I'm talking about. So this is like one roof, and then this one is... I get... Yeah, I guess it's just like too wide. Huh. Okay, so... Mm, that sucks. This is... Mm. I guess we'll have to do this. We'll have to just line up the wall right here and then just make this kind of like a little sleeping quarters. But the thing is, like, if you don't close the rooms in, uh, sometimes it won't register things correctly when you start building furniture and other stuff. So, let's see. Was it about this far? It would let me build. No, I don't want it on top. I don't want it on top. You guys can't even reach up there anyway. <laughs> that would drive me crazy. Sorry. What what was I what would drive you crazy? What was I talking about? <laughs> Sorry. Um oh, and I also built the wicker roof, so I guess maybe that I don't know, I guess what does it do? Like, does it offer better protection? Not really. It has a little bit more health. That's really about it. Also, I don't- can you- Oh, you can't- Oh, I am so dumb. You have to like- <laughs> You have to like- No! It's still not doing it right. Oh yeah, the roof not working. Yeah, I know. No, it drives me freaking insane. It's annoying. Um, Like, it doesn't wanna- Like, why? Okay, we'll see now. This works. But why? We bastard. <laughs> no, look how ugly that looks. <laughs> it looks ugly. Oh well, whatever. I guess it doesn't matter what your house looks like as long as you have shelter. But still, it's pissing me off. Okay, and you can like change. 
I want to select all the walls. Why can't I select the walls on moss? Okay, whatever. Just select it like this. And I want to change the, uh, ew, that's ugly. Never mind. I want, <laughs> never mind. I don't want it to look like that. Dude, we have six people. That's the most people we've ever had at once, I think. <laughs> I don't know. I really don't, I, I never checked like my stream statistics. I'm not really sure how many people I've had all at once. All right, and then we're gonna do two doors, like a little double door situation. Oh, that actually works. I didn't think that would work. Thought it was gonna lay down as two individual doors. Okay, so Kartha, uh, one of his traits is that he doesn't really like sleep much. So I'm gonna do what I said I'm gonna do, and I'm gonna scroll down through the layers. Come on. There we go. That's another weird thing about this game. There's like layers. Okay, I just have sheep or like goats or whatever just in in my house okay um hopefully they don't come eat my food so we're gonna stockpile here just like i said select it clear all and then i'm gonna do food eh, just food whatever we'll just put it all together we don't care about health safety and and like health health standards um like <laughs> like we, we don't have health standards this is going medieval this is not olive garden which doesn't have very good health standards anyway either, but I digress. Um, <laughs> so I'm going to have Kartha go, where was that deer carcass? Wait, oh wait, that's right, I scrolled. I went down. All right, it was over here somewhere, there we go. That's the only thing that kind of sucks, is if you forget what lair you're on, you'll, like, lose track of everything. Carta! Carta! Get up. No empty spot! Hello? Honestly, I think this game is fun. It's gonna get even funner, too, like, as time goes by. Because they're gonna- they just keep adding stuff, and it's really nice. It's raw material, right? Is that- is that why I'm- Raw material. Does that count as food? No, that counts as material. So hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I don't want to lose all my time. Seeds, warfare, fodder, trophies. No, carcass, animal. Okay, yeah, actually, this is what I was talking about. Animal carcasses. Okay, so yeah, we want animal carcasses and food there raw raw or not so Kartha gonna send you out and then Finala I'm gonna see what we can do with the animals can I I can train the goats <laughs> what can I train them to do can I train them to do my taxes <laughs> All right, what else do I need to do? So we got we got a home, we got a roof, and we got all that. We got a food stockpile inside. Oh, these goats are like stuck inside. didn't think about that whoops <laughs> so well should I slaughter them like so we can at least eat <laughs> uh, okay so it's not winter yet it is spring we have we have a while before winter comes so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make like a small little porch area kind of with a little this is the woman in me talking, sorry. Um, we're gonna make it look cute. <laughs> we're, we're gonna make our, we're gonna make our, our place look nice. Um, we're all of the same faith, I'm pretty sure. So, let's see. So, a wicker fence. We'll put that, um, a limestone fence. I feel like a limestone fence wouldn't look right yet, right now. Dude, th that okay, that's annoying. I do wish it would like auto snap to 
where it's supposed to like like how it's supposed to orient itself but there we go so like i have to yeah you have to that's a little annoying i'm not gonna lie but you do have to assign it like space and then i guess we'll just leave the torches in i'm not done i'm not done let me finish building Okay, so there's a fence, and then we have the wicker gate, which is gonna go right there. Decorations, let's go! Yes, I am not a Call of Duty or FPS streamer. When we say let's go, it's because we, we made economic growth. <laughs> Sheepdog celebrates the economy! <laughs> what are these? Oh, birch saplings. I was like, what is that? Oh, I built over my stockpile. I'm an idiot. Um, can I unstockpile this? Or... No? Mm, I didn't foresee... Not a very good planner, not gonna lie. <laughs> okay, so... Oh, we need a butchering table, right? Okay, so... Um, I think we should keep, like raw meat away from ourselves so behind a fence is probably fine i don't know i don't imagine that the other animals like the wild animals and everybody can like get to it so all right so we've got a wood stockpile we should probably stockpile like allocate a stockpile for stone as well just for when the time comes if we live that long <laughs> so we're gonna make a big Stone stockpile right here. Clear all. Material. Raw material. Mm, salt, clay. Mm, excuse me. Uh, we'll make it for limestone and clay. I guess. Because you'll probably use both of them in tandem. Um, Alright, so after that we want... A campfire so that we can cook and then a research table so that we can research and do anything I plan everything <laughs> wolf I plan everything like to a concerning amount um, oh we should probably build a window in our house too that would <laughs> that might make it a little bit more homely but yeah so we'll put a window there and then maybe one like Oh, this is fine. Yeah, we'll do one right there. Just to get a little bit more light in the house, because it's, like, super dark in there. Um, maybe I shouldn't slaughter a goat, like, on... Oh, that's... Duh. I need a floor to finalize a building, I believe. It has to have a floor, a roof, and whatever else. Floor, roof, door. Yeah. Floor, roof, wall, door. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> For sure that's what it needs. Um... Nobody has answered my question, by the way, um, about what, how the stream is presenting itself. I don't know the title of my stream. It's not showing correctly on one of my, my apps, so I hope it's showing correctly. Because I don't want people to come in thinking they're getting cooking games and then they get <laughs> going medieval. Um, my animals are hungry. Which ones? This one? This stupid goat? I'll kill you. <laughs> <laughs> you ungrateful little goat like I'll, ki I'll kill you what is that oh it's for all oh, okay so it's like all food okay so I'm gonna have Kartha butcher this deer come on my cat just screamed he said ah! Ah! <laughs> construction failed okay why are you guys just you know you have to actually use the hammer, right? You have to actually, like, use it correctly to actually make stuff happen with it. <laughs> oh, sweet. Okay, cool. I just want to make sure that it actually shows correctly. Oh, I have a video I need to release today. I'm playing, um, The Last Faith. I'm sure you guys have noticed at this point. But... There's another game that I filmed and uploaded today. I just need to release it. Okay. It'll get exciting, I promise. This is just like the beginning. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little bit tired. Um, 
Okay, so I'm gonna have Garth do this. Um, we'll just have him make... Well, uh, let's see, until we have... We already have 25, right? Okay, um, I'll just have him do it. Like, he can just go... Waiting for worker. Yeah, I wanna... How do I specifically assign Garth? Garth! <laughs> Study! There we go. Damn, a last faith stream would be nice. I can do it. I can maybe like feature one of the episodes as a stream. Um, this game is a little bit more popular and it's a little bit less um, skill based. So I decided to stream this one. But uh, yeah, let's see. I want Kartha to take care of this freaking deer carcass because we <laughs> the fruit flies are back. Oh my god, I was literally just thinking earlier too, like, oh my god, it's so nice how I don't freaking have any fruit li fruit flies. <laughs> like, they, they finally disappeared. Oh, how wrong I was. <laughs> but yeah, this, um, this, this, uh, chat overlay is not really my favorite, so. Also, I'm sorry I didn't, like, schedule. Okay, so the reason that I didn't, like, schedule the stream so that it would let you guys know is because um, I don't know how to do that on Restream for like one channel. Um, I was gonna, what I usually do is I set up the live in YouTube and then I schedule it so that people get the notification and that they can plan on when to join the stream. But with Restream, I don't know how to do that. So I kind of just jump on and hope people come watch. Um, Cause like nobody follows my Twitter or anything. Um, and I'm sure like, I don't know how many people actually see my YouTube text updates. So yeah, I'm not exactly sure how to actually get people's attention and have them ready to come play. Maybe a blasphemous stream. We could maybe do like a blasphemous uh, stream. Like if I, like I'll beat the game, finish the playthrough and then we can do like streams. Um, the only thing that sucks is that I just don't have a lot of time to stream because I'm so damn busy with work, but luckily I had this weekend off and I have next weekend off, so I'll be able to do more streaming, but we need to unlock this and then we have 12 left and then we can get basic agriculture, which we should probably get into soon. Um, and that is going to be, did I give that skill to Finala or Garth? Dude, I actually kind of want to do a comic about these three. Like, I love their characters. <laughs> um, let's see. Okay, so I had her. She's, like, just really weak and mostly good for, like, doing stuff around the property. Kartha's the big hunt, the big game hunter. <laughs> and then Garth is also a little bit frail. So he's more like the... Just the fool. He's the fool of the village. I mostly watch your vids on my own. Are you talking about like, um, like just on your own time, like going watch the the pre-recorded videos? Uh, so, oh, oh, I've got a pile of them. I should probably make a bookshelf if that's the case. I don't know how to use beams yet either. By the way, I did not get that far. Okay, we don't have that. Um, we don't have that researched yet for bookshelves. Um, I want my goats out of my house. <laughs> Um, you know what? We don't, we don't need goats. We don't need goats. We, <laughs> we, uh, as far as the cat being stuck in here, not sure. Not sure what we're gonna do about that. Oh, okay, yeah. I feel like that's what most people do. They kind of just hang around and... Oh, wait. Rope. Rope the goat. Um, and bring him outside. Rope the goat. Grab the goat. Fine, we're gonna eat it. Whatever. I don't care. We need the food anyway. <laughs> Why is the right click so like stingy sometimes? Come on. Just starting your fear and hunger termina playthrough. Okay, yeah. Uh termina. I think Termino was more popular than the original on my channel. Um, except for my like specialty videos, like the dating sim and the Smasher Pass. The Sm I was going through my analytics the other day and the Smasher Pass has 
a ridiculous amount of views. Like, <laughs> a ridiculous amount of views. Um, all right, let's get our, let's get our shit together. Let's, um, a cabbage field. Ooh, cabbage is good. Birch trees, maple trees. Oh, I wonder if we can make maple syrup. That would be cool. I love maple syrup. Like, genuine maple syrup is so freaking good. Um, but we're gonna start a small little cat. We're, we're going to make a cabbage patch. The only thing that's bad is that the even the grassy terrain is not super, super grassy. It's mostly, um, it's still a little rocky. I chose, like, a huge map. Oh my goodness. But... We'll make like a little cabbage patch. We have a we have like a little place right here that's a little more grassy rather than rocky. So we'll make Hello, can I thank you. <laughs> yeah, we'll make a little cabbage patch right here. Yep, I figured. Okay. Well, there's that. And oop, sorry, I clicked out of my game. No, 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 no. Oh, I was supposed to say, oh god, I clicked out of my game. Don't make it crash. Saving just in case. Uh, um, uh, the, the Wolf Clan. We are the Wolf Clan. That's more, no, no, it's more German. Um, we, we are the Wolf Clan. <laughs> we, we are the Wolf, the Wolf siblings. That's right. Die. <laughs> Sorry, there is a fly. Um, no. No! I'm saving! No, I'm saving! I'm saving! Okay, thank you. Oh my god. Okay, 516. Yes. And I can delete this one. So I know which one is which. <laughs> oh my god, stop stop threatening to crash on me. You're as bad as the original PlayStation 2. You guys ever own a PlayStation 2? And like, when you were a kid, you like, acted like you didn't care if it would start up because for some reason if you pretend it like you didn't care if it started it would it would start more <laughs> and what makes me sad is now these are siblings canonically speaking i made them as siblings but so don't don't come at me weird i'm just saying um they're supposed to <laughs> yeah <laughs> I, I wish we could breed settlers, like, make children, so that you can expand your population, because currently the only way to get settlers is, like, random events. People just, like, come in. Um, having kids and families and stuff is planned in future releases, but right now you just have individual adults. So, like, these people are all technically not related, but in my canon they are for the storyline, right? Um, so, but yeah, I wish we could actually have families and stuff, because... I want to, like, build a legacy. Where's the... Hey, sleeping spot. That's what I want. Back then it was normal. Yeah, I know, but it's not normal now. <laughs> so, I guess I'll have the boys sleep on that side and Fenala can sleep on this side. Um, how do I set... Okay, it has to be built first. No, back then... I know, I know what was... I know what was normal back then. It's not- it's just not necessarily good now. <laughs> there are some reasons that things change the way they do. I feel like the- it's really finicky. Like, the right-click system for you to, like, go do specific stuff. I feel like it's really finicky. <laughs> yeah, there's a reason some things change. Oh, Garth! Okay, Garth is just like, I'm gonna just fall asleep at the table. Whatever. <laughs> and Alice is like, Garth, are you gonna go to bed? And he's like, yep. Right here. <laughs> Dude, that's how my ex-boyfriend was. He could sleep anywhere. And I'm like, how? How do you do that? I can't sleep unless I am, like, deathly tired. I can't sleep unless I am horizontal on a pillow on a somewhat soft surface and have like a blanket of some kind. If I don't have that, I can't sleep. Him, he'd fall asleep anywhere. He'd fall asleep on like the passenger seat of, of my car, which was really uncomfortable, <laughs> but he could literally sleep anywhere at any time whenever he pleased. Um, and I wish I was like that. I wish I could just fall asleep anywhere. That would make my life a lot easier. Okay, so uh, we need to go Mining, I guess. Okay, so everybody's sad. Um, Garth 
is also the chef. So I'll have to have him cook some meals. What's... Uh, 12. We'll have four meals worth for everybody. I can sleep... I don't know how you do that. Oh my gosh. I could not... I've never fallen asleep on my feet. Um, well, I mean, like, I've, like, dozed off, but, like, never, like, fully stayed asleep. Um, but, um, I have fallen asleep while driving before, which is, like, obviously super not good. <laughs> but it happens. So I'll have Kartha here, put Garth there, and then Finala can sleep on that one. How is my food low? Well, yeah, I mean, if you lean on a wall, but, like, even still, like, I still can't sleep. Like, if my... I, I can't. I can't. I have to be laying down. Or at least sitting down and, like, leaning on something, but I cannot fall asleep, like, standing on something. <laughs> so how do we mine? Right, right, right. Oh, and, uh, research. Let's see what else we can do. So we've got eight. I want, um, furniture one, so I can have bookshelves so we can preserve our books. But Kartha is a slow ass. No, no, wait, no. Why is Kartha there? No, 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 no. Kartha, why are you there? I want you hunting. You're supposed to be hunting. You are supposed to be hunting, sir. We have no food. <laughs> You're supposed to be hunting. Actually, you know what, Kartha? Um, go make yourself useful and go chop down some trees. And then Garth is supposed to be. Why are you stockpiling? That's not what I want you to do. Yeah, no, I want you here. I don't care. No, I didn't, unless I'm getting them confused and it is my fault. <laughs> Cause Kartha and Garth are kind of like close visually on the screen to look at, whatever. Whatever, fine, we'll make Kartha better at researching, I guess, whatever. Even though he's supposed to be freaking the hunter, whatever, and it's a special table, you know, whatever. <laughs> what is this? Ooh, dirt. We all know how much I love dirt. If you, uh, if you watch the original Fear and Hunger playthrough, you will know the problem with dirt and sheepdog. <laughs> Can you guys hear the guy passing by my apartment? Dude, we have, like, um, hollow core doors, so, like, sound from the inner sanctum of the apartment complex, um, just comes straight through. I hear noise all freaking day long because people are always passing by my apartment, and there it's a hollow core door, so I really wish we could- what's the word? Um, what's the word? Um, it starts with a P. Whenever you like, oh, petition, petition. I wish we could petition to get them to replace everybody's doors with solid core doors. Yeah, so you know what I'm talking about. Great. Oh, <laughs> it's a well-known meme on my channel. I should make dirt an emote on you. <laughs> I, should, I should make I should make a dirt uh em emote or emoji on YouTube. So you have to pay for the membership to get the the. You have to pay for the membership to get the emotes. Like I said, I've tried to make it free, but the, the the cheapest I can make it was 99 cents. But you can get the emotes that way. Um, I should make a dirt emote, though. Or, like, I think you can make, like, custom GIFs. I'll make, like, a get, like a dirt-eating GIF <laughs> or something. Um, junk? Junket. What is that? What is junket? Huh. I don't know what that is. Dude! Oh, yeah! Speaking of which, I was talking about merch the other day, and I was like, I think I'll, like, if people want it, I'll start thinking about merch when I hit maybe, like, 5k, because I feel like 3k subscribers is too little people to, like, to, like, make merch for, because, like, I don't think that many people would want to buy merch. Um, that little of people would want to buy merch, more to say. Um, but, yeah, like, if I make merch, would you guys buy a dirt shirt? <laughs> <laughs> like, a, just like, uh, I, I am a fan. Uh, 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 we'll, we'll make one where it says, like, um, only the real fans of the silent sheepdog eat dirt. <laughs> That's the initiation into my cult, my sheepdog cult. Um, instead of drinking the Kool Aid, you eat the dirt. <laughs> uh, all right. 
I'll consider it. I'll put it on a shirt. Maybe I'll put it on pants. We could put it on the ass. Like, you know how they have those those shorts that say juicy? But it's it's jeans and it says dirt. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, Kartha, I think we're low on food. Why is everybody idle? Get to work! We have an industry to build. What do we need to do, really? Like, other than Garth researching, um, I don't really know what else we need to do. How many do we have now? Research is like the most important thing. So we just need that to be doing and done. When did I start this stream, by the way? It's been 50 minutes. Okay, so I started around almost an hour ago. So like 4, 10, 4, 15. I was going to stream for like maybe two or three hours because I'm trying to get them subs up. You know what I mean? There's nobody watching on Twitch right now, but oh well. Only the most hardcore fans get it. Yeah, for real. I, I like I know who's real. I know who the homies are. <laughs> I know who the real homies are. No! Sheep dog, stop! Quit clicking out of the game, you're gonna make it crash. Oh, I keep forgetting. <laughs> it's like the worst thing that could happen right now. Actually, you know what? Um just because I know my computer. I know it. <laughs> But yeah, so I actually have a plan to build myself a, a voiceover booth, uh, which will also obviously be for the gaming uh, stuff. Um, you guys know those big, like, I know this sounds so 18-year-old college guy streamer, but I'm gonna get one of those loft beds and then at the bottom like where the, where it's lifted and you can put a desk under it's gonna have a built-in desk I'm gonna buy the the, the metal frame kind that come with a built-in like plywood or, or plastic desk and then I'm gonna build walls on the four sides of it and maybe like a like a like a um a futon sliding door or something um so I can get a soundproof not soundproof but a sound treated booth that kind of reigns in my voice um, and blocks out a little bit more sound, so I can also use it for voiceover. Because right now, like I said, uh, with a, a hollow core door, you can hear everything going in and out. So it's just kind of, you know, I want to make sure I have better sound and, and a little bit more isolation. But that's the plan. I'm going to invest in one of those beds. Oh, also, I live in a studio apartment, so, you know, I need the room anyway. So my bed will be up. That'll free up some space. I'll have a like a like a semi prefabricated booth that I just have to like attach walls to, and then I can use the back corner of my apartment for something else. So, yeah, I think that will work. Um, it's like three hundred bucks though, so it'll take me a minute to get my hands on one. I could just sell my bed frame that I have now, but then I wouldn't have a bed frame anymore. So I'm I think I'm just gonna be patient and just invest in it whenever the money comes through. But uh. So yeah, that's the plan, because I think it would be cheaper to just do that, and it would save a lot more space than building, like, a... And it would probably be more effective, too, than to just building, like, a regular PVC blanket booth. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I don't know if the rain has any effect on your stuff. I hope not. Um, but at least our crops are getting watered, because I didn't think about that. Excuse me, I did not think about how to water my crops. <laughs> I should probably think about those things before I just randomly start doing that. Um, do sticks not count as wood? Why are those not in the stockpile? Yeah. Come on, guys. Get with it. Wait, who did I have on that? Kartha? Good, good, good. Kartha needs to get his act together. No, I don't want to forbid them. I want you to grab them. I want you to actually start doing what you're supposed to do, sir. You guys are just sitting around being lazy. I say as I sit at my chair all day and be lazy and stream. <laughs> I took today off, though. I took today off from everything. Like, all my... Um... All my jobs. Like, if you can call it work... Um... I, I'm just not doing it today, and I told my boss that. I'm like, look, I have off from my other job. I'm gonna take off today, and 
because I've been working myself to the bone um, and I'm just gonna not do anything. All I've been doing all day is like making YouTube videos and playing video games, which has been so nice. And unfortunately it's like 5.30 PM, so it's almost over. But yeah, I did sleep in a little bit and um, I feel a lot better than I have been this last week. Um, that's the coolest setup I've ever heard of. I think I'm gonna think about that for a man cave. But yeah, and I like it. Like I like those because they're cozy. You put like a little bit of um, LED lights around the top and it's a little cozy cave, a little gamer cave. Um, if I could, I would put like a big TV, like as a, it, it, there's not enough room, but I would put like a TV in there and just use it as a monitor and then like make it a Roku. And then I would just like also use it as like a little mini living room. Like if I could put a couch in there, but I don't think it'll be big enough for that. Um, so I'm just going to make my own little living room in my apartment. But yeah, if I could, I would just like double it up, triple it up even computer space, voiceover booth, and then uh, also like a little mini living room, but I don't think I'll have enough room for all that in there. Oh my god. Ah, hang on. I hate whenever your glasses, uh, ah, I hate whenever your glasses get all like smudgy and your whole vision starts getting really blurry. I need new glasses so bad too. These are like from high school. I can't see shit, y'all. Like, I can't see anything and people are like, why do you wear why do you wear those crazy looking contacts? Cause I don't have health insurance. <laughs> and, um, I can't get regular clear contacts. So I wear like costume prescription contacts. Um, but yeah. So also my glasses, like I said, are from like high school. Finally, finally. We have okay. Um, but yeah, my my glasses are from high school, so I can't see anything because the prescription is like years and years and years expired. Uh, it's probably extremely unhealthy, but you know. Whatever. Alright, so let's get this bookshelf built. I think I'm gonna just put it right there. That looks... That... That... that I wanna... <laughs> Can I turn it? Can I turn it? No, you have to turn it when you're... Okay, well, that's annoying. Um, but I want it... I at least want it like flush with the wall. Somewhat. There. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I think it'll be a nice idea. It'll save me a little bit of money in the long run, too, because I'll kill a bunch of birds with one stone. I wonder if you- oh no, I was gonna say, I wonder if I could see you guys use the special emojis I made in the restream chat, but you have to be a member to use it anyway, so you guys wouldn't be able to test it right now anyway, so. um. I am looking forward to getting Streamlabs instead, just because there's a lot more that comes with it, and like I said, the, the aesthetics of uh, Restream are not, eh, they're not the greatest. <laughs> um, you, guys, you guys don't need to see all that, it's mostly just the furniture and the other stuff, it's just like menus and whatnot. Uh, wait. A rough awning marking a spot where items change hands. Peddlers and street merchants. Will we... So, would we... Pen marker? What is that? Places in an enclosure... Oh, okay. Um, Would we attract merchants if we put one up like this? That would be nice. Because then I wouldn't have to wait for them to come by, I guess. Or they'd come by more frequently, maybe. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Can I move this... Relocate, yeah. I want it like. Well, that did nothing. I want. <laughs> I just want to move it. Uh. I just wanted. To, I just wanted to move it closer. I wanted to move it closer to the. Uh... Oh, I can turn it on and off. That's cool. No, what? Oh, oh, oh! She has to actually pick it up and move it. I wanted to move it like just to the in closer to the inside of the thing, but. Like right there. Yeah, and I want to move this one back too. I didn't want it on the outside. That's stupid. Let's get this stream to at least 10 people. I think that would be a good benchmark. I, I genuinely don't remember the most people I've ever streamed to at one time on YouTube. At one time on TikTok, I think I had about maybe 300 people all at once, which is probably my greatest streaming achievement of all time. But yeah, 
It's, <laughs> YouTube doesn't bring in a whole lot of people, which is weird because I have 3,000, almost, well, almost. I have, I have 2,731, yeah, it, on the dot, um, subscribers now. So, but they don't ever really stop in for streams. I guess I just don't really have stream watchers, which is fine. I don't really watch streams much anyway. Um, I enjoy streaming, but I don't really enjoy watching streams. There is only one person who I watch stream, and that's Queso. He's the only person that I've ever actually sat down, enjoyed, and have been entertained by in a stream. <laughs> uh, everybody else I watch pre-recorded. Um, other stuff, I don't, I don't really watch their streams. I think maybe once I watched a Markiplier stream. I don't know, but... Yeah, I never really was a big stream watcher. That's mostly just because I lived in places that have no real uh, good internet, which I, I finally have my own good internet uh, again. But yeah, I always lived in places with like terrible internet, so watching streaming was kind of a hard thing to do because, I don't know, maybe it's just their settings and then the bandwidth, but I never- it, it was hard to watch streams because they would always be buffering. And yes, Kesto is hilarious. Kesto is one of the funniest uh, streamers I've ever seen. He just keeps me entertained. Like, he's just... <laughs> I don't know. There's just something about him. He's really, really entertaining. Um, I keep making the joke that I, like, uh, I messaged... I emailed him. And I was like, Queso, you're funny. Let's collaborate. And everybody's like, Queso's not gonna answer you. And I'm like, well, he might. I'm gonna shoot my shot. Listen, I could die tomorrow, okay? So I'm gonna... If there's a shot to be shooted, I'm going to shoot that shot. <laughs> because if I don't, you never know what could happen. Like, you never know what could happen, you know? You never know. Maybe somebody will say yes, and then people will finally find my channel and I'll, like, blow up, you know? How do we have no food? Is this growing? I don't have any sunlight. Maybe I should go chop this tree down. Kartha. Go, go, go chop this tree. I have a job for you, boy. <laughs> boy. I, I cannot- oh my god. I can't even- I can't even do that voice. Uh, whoever- I, I don't remember his name. Um, it's the guy- uh, the guy- it's a black voice actor. He does the voice of Kratos for um, God of War. And he has this voice that, that's just resounding like, <laughs> Boy! Boy! <laughs> Like, God, I can't even do it. His voice is so, so bassy. It's, it's insane. But, um, yeah, no, um, yeah, his, his, his fan, that's, that's another thing. I love watching Queso streams because his fans are just as funny as he is. Um, the fans make up, like, half the content. But, um, yeah, no, I, 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 I mean, I don't, you never know. Like, I mean, I feel, I feel, I feel like, I feel like. If I had, you know, maybe like 500,000 subs or followers or whatever, Twitch, whatever, whatever channel I'm on and I'm, I'm a big name, right? And somebody with a couple thousand messages me and I'll be like, oh, like they had the balls to reach out to somebody big. Like, you know, like I, I would go and, and I'd watch their channel and I, I would probably just go from there. Like, I mean, if I'm just not interested, I understand that, which they're like, you know, I don't message- I didn't message him with the expectation, like, he's gonna answer. Um, and if he doesn't, well then, like, oh, you know what I mean? Like, no, I understand. He doesn't know me. No, nobody really does, which is fine. Um, but that my mindset was just, like, just because he's big doesn't mean that I can't message him. You know what I mean? Like, it doesn't make him unreachable. So why not? <laughs> you know? Like- it's not like a pride thing. It's just kind of like, well, why not? You never know what would happen. So, yeah, I, I'm kind of trying to live my life in with like approaching men, like for relationships and uh, people for business relationships like that and opportunities. Like if you can shoot the shot, just shoot the shot. Because if you don't, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Like I know this seems like that's like really meme-y, uh, a really meme saying, but I mean, like it's true. If you don't try, how will you ever know? And so, I do. I am still struggling with the approaching people I find cute thing to be like, hey, would you like to go out? Because I do, I am still a little nervous, I'm not gonna lie. But I try. I, I, I at least consider it and try to muster up the courage to do things like that. Yeah, they really do. Um, 
I don't remember. One of my good friends who I met in uh, middle school, um, she ended up being a really good friend to me. Uh, she doesn't live in the same state anymore, and we haven't seen each other in person in a long time, but, like, the relationship is still there, right? Um, her, I just went up to my group of friends who I kind of knew, saw her, started talking to her because she was in the group at that time, and then we had sleepover after sleepover. I never missed one of her birthdays. Like, we sat together on the bus and we talked and all that good stuff and like we just became really good friends um and it lasted past high school so yeah just from going up and talking to her so absolutely like that's how you grow in relationships in your career if you're not willing to go say hey hi my name is sheepdog and i do this and that like then you'll you'll never know <laughs> you know even on online forums um or places like that you'd be like hey I notice you do this. I do this too. Or I love the way you do this. I do this. Would you like to be like, you never know who's going to see your stuff. So yeah, absolutely. Everybody should be shooting their shot. <laughs> so wait, why is Fenella researching? That's not what I want you to do. That's why I made your brother do it. That's why I made your brother do it. <laughs> You're supposed to be handling the animals, even though there's no animals to handle. I guess that is my fault. Um, mm -hmm. Do we have food? We have a low stockpile. Ooh, we should probably, yeah. Why do you guys keep changing out? Stop changing out. Go butcher this goat. Would you get out of my way? <laughs> Kartha, go butcher this goat. That's what you're good at. That's what you're you're here for. I don't want you studying. You're not supposed to be super intellectual. You're supposed to be the big brother. Oh. Oh, the goats had names. Oh, I didn't know the goats had names. That's sad. Lucy and Shvetko. Oh, that makes it sadder. <laughs> I didn't realize they had names. Hey, how you, how you doing? Yeah, it is interesting. Um, like I said earlier, it is still like super early access. So, I mean, it's not like super, super uh, interesting. But as a colony builder from the, the ground up, kind of, um, it's nice. So, uh, you know, I think that everyone wants brain smarts. I want to be brain smart. I would rather be brain smart than, than book smart. Like, I would rather have actual intelligence than textbook memorization which um is kind of where i lean anyway like common sense i was never book smart i i was i never did really good in school so i mean i guess i i, I guess i'm somewhat on that side um but i think this would be a good time to interject and introduce everyone to the canon the storyline that i've got going here if you're interested uh you, if you're not you could leave you could leave the stream this is what i'm about people i'm about story i'm about creation but uh yeah, no, I'm just, this is, okay, so this is the older brother. He's the eldest. He's like the family sire, what what, what have you. Um, he's 25 years old. His name is Kartha, um, not Kahara. I know they sound quite similar. Um, this was the worst time for the merchant to come and interrupt me, but he's the big brother and he's like the sire, not the sire, the sire, because the, the sire is like the father of the, of the line, but he's the, what's the word? He, he handles it. He handles his siblings. And then also uh, when the merchant showed up on my first, like on my alone playthrough, I couldn't find him. <laughs> Where is he? There. What are you doing all the way over there? I am not going to walk all the way over to you. <gasps> yeah, there's a dog with him though. I might go out to him just to pet his dog. <laughs> Where are you? Where the, Where the hell are you? I can't even- you're so far away, I- I can't even see you. You're all the way up the mountain. Why are you all the way up there? I can't even reach you! How do I- how do- how would I- How would I even get to you? I- I- I'm not dealing with this. I- I- I have a story to tell. I'm not dealing with this. <laughs> um, he's standing in the void. <laughs> he's watching. He's watching from the void. Um. Patriarch. 
patriarch yeah so right yes he's 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 the operating thank you so much Steph. he's the operating patriarch of the family and then there's the second void merchant <laughs> that's another thing we can put on a shirt void merchant <laughs> but this is garth he's the second eldest did i pause whoops <laughs> he's the second eldest um, he's kind of like the kind of stupid, younger, goofy brother who, he's not really good at anything except, like, domestic work, and, you know, he's not super strong or big or whatever, he's just kind of an average guy. He's like an average Joe, but he's a jokester, and, you know, he kind of keeps the morale up. He's kind of like a Sokka archetype, almost. Um, and then there's obligatory little sister, Fanala. Um, she and Garth are the same age, she's just really short. <laughs> <laughs> is that uh Steph, is that a a reference to <laughs> Was it my fear and hunger? <laughs> was it my <laughs> Was it my fear and hunger uh <laughs> playthrough where I was like Don't get too silly <laughs> I really hope that's what you're referring to, but if not, that it's also still a really funny comment to be like, this is Garf. Uh, he's he's he, he's just a guy, but you know sometimes he gets a little too silly, <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> but yeah, no, oh my god, I, I always I always laugh at that one moment. I think I'm pretty. It was either Termina or it was the first one where I'm just like, <laughs> we're, getting, we're getting a little silly here. Now don't get too silly. <laughs> I don't. I know I said it. I just don't remember when and where. But uh, this is Garthia, and then there's uh, uh, Finala. She's the obligatory younger sister. Um, she's good with like animals. And like she's the little rough houser. Um, I, I can show you like their titles. Like it says suede in him, but I mean it's just like their title. Uh, it gives them like personality traits. But he's the ghost of. I I, I didn't get to choose the names of the 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 places. I only got to choose the titles. But um, he's he's like antisocial, strong soldier, big brother type. And then Garth has, look at his traits. I mean, he's got a mustache for God's sake, but the fool, and then she's the broken, um, which I kind of just wanted her to be. Perhaps and chancingly, maybe. Yes, perhaps and chancingly, she's, she's the sleeper agent. She's, like, Garth, like, Kartha might have the sword, but she's the sleeper. She, she, she's like moist critical. You look at it, and you look at her and you're like, oh yeah, she's not much to look at, but when, well, but when, but when the bow comes out. Now that you say that, I think it's the first. I don't remember. I genuinely don't remember, but yes, it's, it's really, I don't even know why I said it. Like, why would I say that in a fear and hunger video? I'm gonna have to go back and watch. I, I recently saw it. I just can't remember. Can I harvest this now? Is this, my, my cabbage has full hit points. Okay. <laughs> so my cabbage has health points, uh, but okay. Um, I guess we can go. I'll get Fanala because it's like her whole thing to be the the domestic uh, <sighs> maintainer, maintainer of the property, stewardess of the property. Um, how much research do we have? That's kind of like the main thing is just trying to get stuff. Okay, so what should we go for now? I think so. There are gonna be raids. I don't know how many people you can get currently in your tribe, um, but mm, we're on. We're only on day four of spring. We really don't need to learn how to tailor anything. Maybe yeah. Let's let's go for making weapons um, because we are going to need to know how we're we're going. To, we only we have two bows, I think, and a spear. But I want to make sure we can actually make weapons. A woodworking bench, yeah. What's a bow bow years table? What does that do? A bench with timber. Oh, for bows and tools for carpentry. Okay. Is this game like 3D Rimworld? Yeah, that's kind of what people are like comparing it to. Um that's what it feels like from what yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm so I never played Rimworld, but that's kind of what they're going for here, except it's fully medieval. Um, if I, I, like I said, I never played RimWorld, not super familiar with it, but, uh, I'm pretty sure RimWorld has, like, like, options to be like this, but it's also, you can have tech in it, right? Like, there's, like, um, evolution, I think. Sorry, I hit my mic. Um, 
there's like evolution right of like 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 technology and tools uh if i am correct but this is um yeah this is just exactly what the title says it's just going medieval <laughs> so i will be right back guys don't get too silly in the chat while i go use the bathroom uh i will be right back hold it down for me All right, I am back. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, grab the silly goose spray. Uh, what's funny is I'm tending to my farm and my animals. Yeah, we're just we're just farm buddies. Wait, does anyone know where it is? Oh, <laughs> the silly goose spray. You fool! I took it with me. I keep it in the bathroom cabinet because of I know, I know, <laughs> I know you're going to look for it. Whoa, wait, what happened while I was gone? Oh, the merchant came. I was like, who the hell is this? <laughs> he literally walked the entire way to get here. All right, what can I do for you? Well, you're a tall fellow, aren't you? No, you fiend. I keep it in, I, I keep it in, the, in, the, uh, in the bathroom uh, cabinet, which I actually don't have. I don't have a bathroom. <laughs> I don't have a bathroom cabinet. The, the bathroom here is like really, really small. It's a toilet. And it, oh, I'm sorry, it's a turlet. It's a turlet and <laughs> and a bathtub with a uh, yeah, damn, damn boy. Look at them legs, the little chicken legs. <laughs> How do I barter with him? Ah, there we go. A select settler. Um, Kartha's the big talker, so I'm like, would you stop running around? Also, how did you get in my house? Who let him in? Who let him in here? Most people knock. <laughs> tutorial bartering okay so bartering functions this is the one thing i haven't done uh the one thing it's one of the things i haven't done he has a quirky hat it's like a the robin hood hat from shrek shrek one the first one you let your <laughs> thoughts went on that idea um giving them is considered a gift and he will influence alignment ah ah i see but yeah, he has that Robin Hood hat from Shrek 1. Oh, merry men! <laughs> oh, how, how, how does that song go? Hey! Oh, God. Oh, uh. Oh, man. I haven't seen the original Shrek in a minute. Um. Alright, so how do I bart? What does he have? What What is this? Simple healing. Oh, okay. This is his stuff. Okay. Sorry. This is one of the... He broke in with void magic. He's like an enderman. Oh, God. I, I had a Minecraft playthrough. Um, it's one of my, my Minecraft and word vomit videos. Um, and I, I built my house like over three blocks tall. And I had an enderman that I made angry. And he, he was hunting me in my own house. Um... I don't see- I don't- well, he has carrot seeds. He has carrot seeds and a dog. Honestly, I don't know what the point of the domestic animals are, like the pets, because they don't do anything from what I've seen. But... Mm, I really don't want my cat. Cannot be protected by pre- Yeah, like, their animals are- Really, animals are just a liability right now, I think. Like, you can't... You can't really... I don't... I don't want... I really don't want a pet. If I can get rid of the cat, that would be great. So I can give it to him. I steal from... <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Somebody actually... Somebody actually knows the lyrics. 
I still feel the rich and I give to the needy. I keep so much, but I'm not greedy. I rescue petty damsels. Man, I'm good. How does it... Oh, wait. Man, man I'm good. Uh, something, something. Monsieur Hood. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, we should do a we should do a Shrek stream like where we watch Shrek together. That would be fun. I'd get copyrighted so fast, but um I don't know. It wait, it, it, is Shrek in the copyright laws still? How long is it? Is it 50 years or se 50, 60, 70 something like that before before you can do it without copyright claims? I don't remember. It is it's Dreamworks though, so I don't know if I want to play with that. Um let's see. 49 49 is that gold is that what that is well dude he comes from a place called wolferlo and i come from a place called wolfwood what it, tell me that's not a coincidence like <laughs> um so what are, what is what is what is what, what are those though these are chronicles so this is us and this is him okay so i'll give him my cat because i don't think the cat does anything um Oh, this is what uh, 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 uh. um what is this an apple sapling we could use apples apples are a winter fruit right so it would be worth it barley beet seeds let's let's get some beets yeah you can have a watch along with scrambled audio Wait, scrambled audio? Wait. What does that mean? I'm sorry, I'm not familiar with that. Okay, I will take... You will acquire... Are you sure you want to finalize this barter? Do you want to finalize this barter? You can have a cat. <laughs> uh, you receive a cat. I receive seeds. <laughs> Depending on if you have a house or not, I feel like a cat is worth more than some seeds. So I feel like you got a pretty good deal, Gun. Not gonna lie. Wait. Is that your dog? I thought your your dog looks so much bigger from far away. Beats? <laughs> um Uh what's it? That little Russian Russian old lady meme with that uh is it a Borzoi? I forget. The the, the little ones that look funny, the, the Russian dogs. Where he's like, You're my little Russian lady. Please give me many beats. <laughs> <laughs> Please, we we are we are Russian siblings. Give us many many bits. <laughs> okay, we're on day four. So each season has five days. Um, ooh, grab those. Grab that. Grab that. Grab that. I want. I want to plant. I want to plant. Okay, we're saving. Thank God. <laughs> Hello, welcome to my uh, to our to uh, I can't. <laughs> Hello and welcome to our farm. I do not do a good Russian accent. I'm sorry. I don't know how they say a lot of these words. I'm just gonna wing it. Hello and welcome to our farm. Our farm. God, I don't even know. What to Every time the dog takes a step, it gets bigger. It's not perspective. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he just he, Clifford the time bending dog, <laughs> time and space warping dog. So wait, I should be able to plant something then, right? Like the new seeds. Would you stop going so fast? I'm not. I don't. My brain doesn't work quick enough. You can leave. You know. You can leave if you want. I don't- you don't need to stick around here. Ah. Perhaps that's why. Nothing is working. Because I'm not selecting things in the right order. So you're just gonna leave it on the ground, but like I don't have a stockpile for it? I guess I gotta make a bigger friggin' de default stockpile. I'm tired of this happening. My brain only- yeah, same. Same. <laughs> <laughs> same, same, same. Oh, spring five. Kartha has developed to a devout oak brethren. No longer- wait, I wasn't done! I wasn't done reading that! I wasn't done! <laughs> I wasn't done! 
I don't know why all of a sudden I just got really big Witcher vibes from that music. Speaking of which, okay, so guys, most people don't know this about me, but I used to do belly dancing, right? Um, it's one of my favorite forms of dancing. I love dancing in general, but it's, it's one of my favorite forms of, of, of dance. And um, the, I don't remember the title, but like the main song from The Witcher that plays when you're in battle, like, I don't know if it, if the soundtrack changes as the game goes on. I didn't get super, super far into it, but like at the very beginning where it's like, like that one, I used to belly dance to that song because it has such a good beat. Like it's, oh my God, it's such an amazing song and it's got like such a, it's so danceable. I love it. There's just a quick little fun fact. But um, the music from The Witcher is just... The Witcher 3, specifically, is so freaking good. Um, I almost beat The Witcher 2 when I had an Xbox. Um, the Witcher 3 is just so damn big. Um, I beat one or both... Are there three? I can't remember. I beat one or both or two out of three if there were three of the Witcher 3 DLC, but I never beat the, um, <laughs> a good beat, but I never beat the, um, I never beat the main game. I don't even remember how far I got. Um, <laughs> okay, we get it. Don't beat a dead horse. Okay. Um, but yeah. Okay. So what do we need to do here? How much, uh, how much research do we have? This is something I'm curious about too, is the region tab. I want to actually see the people because like you can connect with, um, I think the merchant comes and then maybe like three days later you get a raid or a new person or something. Um, but if you unlock the region tab, I think you can trade or like, uh, associate with outside, uh, settlements. So we have seven, um, what's the next best thing? I guess we need to start looking into weapons cause that's gonna be coming soon. So I didn't lay down a woodworking bench yet. I will put that here. I'm gonna start small. Um, cause it, since everybody lives in the same house, uh, a basic research table and a bowers table. We have two bows and three people. So I don't think, I think that's fine. We have weapons. We have a spear here and a longbow here. Actually, though, I think it would be... Kartha has the short bow, I'm pretty sure. Did I give it to you? Wait. Uh, inventory. Okay, he's got the short bow. Finala. I'm gonna give her the longbow. Yeah, I'm just... I'm clicking on everything in the wrong order, that's why. So I'm gonna have her equip that. Oh, she can't. Perfect. Um, can I mean I don't? She's not a good warrior. That's like a whole thing. Um, <laughs> Do you need a little tree, donkey? <laughs> okay. She can't. Oh, she can get the spear though. That's good. She can. She can take the spear. Garth, I will have you equipped with the longbow. Never mind. Nobody has the skill. Well, I guess Kartha would then. Because he's the hunter, so he'll probably have it. You see, uh, all getters are like onions. We have... They're, they're smelly? No, well, we, we have layers. <laughs> okay, so I'll get Garth to take the short bow, I guess. Yeah, okay, that's a lower skill. That's good to know, though, because that tells me that the long bow is probably more powerful. Um, I don't know the difference. I, I don't shoot archery I, I wouldn't know um but yeah oh oh we got leather okay uh kartha is the worker so we'll have him a cudgel never heard of that before well i have but i don't know what it actually is a spear and a and dismantling items what it doesn't give me like stats or anything on them oh we should plant those finala i need you to come here uh Grab woman woman <laughs> plant the seeds how do I uh uh the bigger the bow the higher oh that's true because didn't the Japanese like way 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 back in ancient times have like these enormous horrifying bows that were like huge and when they shot them they made like a specific like screaming sound 
it was either the Japanese or, or a different, like, East Asian culture, I think. But, like, I remember that. That's, like, a weird little fun fact that I actually know. Um, why the English longbowman was a fear was fear, fearsome among French knights. What's that armor going to do from an arrow? Yeah. No, yeah, that, that makes sense. Um, a, ma ma well, a, a mace? A mace is, like, a blunt weapon that, um... It's, like, a stick with a big iron ball at the end of it, uh, essentially. Um, that sounds amazing. I should look that up. Yeah, I don't remember what it's called. I'm pretty sure it was the Japanese, um, but th they, like, shoot their bows up and they're huge and, like, they would pull it. And when they shoot, like, the way they fly through the air, I don't know if it's just the way the bow was made or the arrow or whatever, but it literally, like, makes this, like, horrifying screaming sound. It's, like, a super famous fun fact. It's 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 really cool. Um, I'm, try I'm just trying to figure out how I can plant these damn things. Like, it's in my stockpile. I don't understand why I can't... I don't understand why I can't... Because I don't want to trade just for it to decompose. I need you guys to... Finale, your idol. I need you to actually work, babe. Why can't I... Wait, and those are... cat. Wait, those are cabbage seeds. I want to plant my bits. I want to plant my bits. How do I... Can you only... Is it? Is it because they're out of season? Hit points, global position, max stack resources, seize value... Decomposes. I don't want it to decompose. I don't want it to decompose. <laughs> I like the longbow. It's sick. No way I could do it though. Archery's cool, but I don't think I have the strength or the the dexterity for it. I'm not gonna lie. I have very clumsy hands. Um, I actually know. We're not. No is a generous word, but I've spoken with um, and I have him on my friends list. Um. Uh, a Japanese fellow who teaches like this um what's like like this original samurai art it's a very specific form of martial arts that has to do with the swords and forgive me I can't remember exactly what it's called it has a very specific name but um watching him do it is so fascinating um but yeah like yeah, he was like Oh, you, yeah, you'll cut yourself a lot, but you'll get used to it. And I'm like, I would probably kill myself because, or, 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 or seriously injure myself or someone else because I am very clumsy. I do not trust myself with a sword, much less a katana. No, thank you. I don't think I don't think that's a good idea. I think I will just sit here from the from the bleachers, from the from the chairs on the side and I will watch you do it cuz you're really good at it and it looks really cool when you do it, but if I do it, no, it's not going to work. Um a few years ago I heard it's still a law in England you're supposed to still train to Oh, interesting. Very interesting. Um, like a driving license? Wait, 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 what are you talking about? A driver- What are you talking about a driver license? No, my cabbage rotted! No, my cabbage! Wait, why are you guys not cooking? Garth! 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 <laughs> why aren't you freaking cooking? Ooh, we can make axes! Perfect for- with swords! And crossbows! That's what real Vikings use. They don't enforce it anymore. Wait, what? I'm sorry. Am I out of the loop? Did I somehow slip out of the loop while I was talking? Um. Wait, hang on. I need to think for a second. Garth, I need you to come cook. Not enough resources. What if- can you just make cabbage soup or something? How do I- right, edit, okay. Clear all. Cabbage. Use the cabbage. We have cabbage. We got it. This is not fully- that's not- it's not fully rotted. Just use it. Also, why have you not butchered the damn animals, bro? There we go. Okay, so do that. <laughs> My cabbages! The, uh, <laughs> Avatar The Last Airbender. The, uh, the cabbage seller. Yeah. <laughs> My cabbage is.
Okay, everybody can just go do whatever they want then, I guess. You know, screw me. It's not like I'm god of this world or anything. Trying to, to, to get you. the people I created with specific skill sets to do specific jobs so that things are more efficient. No, that's fine. You just go do whatever the hell, whatever the hell you want. <laughs> Decorative structures. Pottery shelf. Tool shelf. Oh, wait, maybe Kartha lost a little bit of, um, what's the word, faith, because we don't have a religious, uh, we don't have anything for them to worship at. Maybe that's why. Um, I don't, I don't want the decorative structures right now, really. Um, so we can make vinegar, alcohol, and cheese. I imagine wine, too, if we can ferment. But we don't have any fruit anyway, and I can't freaking figure out how to... I can't figure out how to plant my apples. We could make apple wine, but we can't plant the apples. <laughs> we, could, we could get some apples and we could sell them on the black market. Where are we gonna get the apples? Right here. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> We're looking for the black market. Get off my- get off my porch! Or what is he saying? Get- get off my lawn! <laughs> is it, uh, Hell no! We ain't off an old less than bucks of- <laughs> Dude, I love potatoes. Baked potatoes with sour cream and cheese. Ay ay, So good. Why didn't you say so? Fifty bucks a pop. <laughs> Hell no! We ain't seen no for those fifty bucks a pop. <laughs> potatoes are high. Oh my god! It's the end of the world if potatoes are high. No way. <laughs> what about this weird looking tree? Hey, little boy. What is? Oh my god! I haven't seen hellbenders in so long. He's like, <laughs> hey, little boy. Why don't you come over? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, smiling friends. It's honestly imp impressive three people manage to survive like this. <laughs> um, smiling friends season two needs to come out already. I know it takes a lot of work for animation, but like it needs to come out already. Zach, if you're watching this, which I know you're not, but if in the odd cosmic chance that you are, hurry up! I need my smiling friends! I need more meme material, honey. I need more stupid things to talk about with people. <laughs> I used to quote, what are, what are they? What's smoking? What's the smoking? There's like little dust clouds that get kicked up like in the, the little dry areas. I think, is that what you're talking about? Like right here? It's just, it's just the, 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 the little dust clouds, I think. Um, I used to always quote the grandma from that one episode of Smiling Friends, though, where she's like, Oh, hello, Charlie. <laughs> grandma, what are you doing here? Oh, I said, I, I, I always quote this part wrong because I'm bad, but I'm paraphrasing. Oh, I said, damn, in 1984. <laughs> or something like that. Because they killed your grandfather. <laughs> yeah, that's not really fair. I don't really think you should be here for that. Uh, so, I <laughs> just so funny. I I should build real beds, shouldn't we? We should build real beds. Take these apart. Oh, I should have set their schedules. Okay, let's let's build actual real beds. There we are. Oh, they're a bit bigger though. That's fine. That's fine. Dave Land, Dave Land, everything happening in Dave Land. Oh, uh, Desmond, we can go to Dave Land. Who's Dave? Well, I don't know. <laughs> He's the owner. <laughs> He's the owner of Dave Land. <laughs> Did you want to show me anything? Oh uh, yeah. Uh, uh, what about that? The ant. <laughs> yeah, uh, okay, anyway, I knew, I knew they should probably get out of here. Yeah, they, they had, a they had little hay, haystacks, little hay, hay piles that they were sleeping on. I'm genuinely amazed we haven't been raided yet. I think the raid, the first raid comes at day, like, 
eight, nine, ten, something like that. The days are actually going by really slow. I'm kind of surprised. Um, no, they had sleeping bags in medieval days. Really? Was that really a question you just asked? No, they were sleeping on hay, hay piles. That's what people did back then. They, they slept in hay. I know, because the bed's not built yet. Whenever... Oh, God, excuse me. Oh, forgive me. I'm a little bit gassy for a second. No, this is, this means it's not built yet. Whenever it's, like, meshy looking. Dave Land. I just thought I should have named it. Dave Land. Having fun at Dave Land. The settlement of Dave Land. <laughs> I shouldn't have given them real Viking names. I should have named them all Dave. Even the girls. Dave, Dave, and Dave. Dave Land. <laughs> we will build a legacy. <laughs> I just feel like the research is going so damn slow. Preserving food. That is something we do need to do. A smokehouse and a shelf. That is good, actually. We're going to start smoking the meat. That way we can preserve it for the winter. Having smoke wheat, uh, smoke, smoke wheat, smoke, smoke meat, smoke meat would be good. Oh, I got an achievement. Yay! No, get out of my chat. <laughs> get out of my chat. I'm not naming them freaking minion names. It's like, like, what, what even are the minion names? I don't even remember. It's like Steve, Dave, and what's the other one? He's like the most popular one, right? It's like, what was his name? I can't even remember. <laughs> Okay, so now we have two beds. I have two beds, Eddie. Now we don't have to sleep on the floor. <laughs> we should build a bed, Eddie. I know, I know Dave is a minion name. They'll forget the other one, though. What's the other one? It's like Dave, Steve, and... <laughs> My brain keeps wanting to say Paul. I can't... It's not Paul. It's definitely not Paul. Yeah, I haven't seen- Despicable Me is funny, though. The Minions movies are absolute trash, but Despicable Me is actually really funny. I like Despicable Me. I like, um, Ho Hotel Transylvania, too, is actually really funny. Um, for being a really silly, a uh, really silly, like, DreamWorks- I'm pretty sure- is it- is, is Hotel Transylvania DreamWorks or is it Universal? I don't remember. Or is it Illumination? I don't- I don't remember. I genuinely can't remember, but like uh, Hotel Transylvania, yeah, it's it's a good, it's really funny. I think they have really funny humor, and the animation is great. I love how they do that bouncy traditional two D animation uh, in three D. I love that about it. It's it's just so full of character. And yes, uh, that is an Ed Ed and Eddie reference in twenty twenty four. I'm uh almost twenty seven years old, so yes, I I grew up during the Cartoon Network Renaissance. Um which I miss every single day. Speaking of which, there's a Courage the Cowardly Dog game coming out. Um, and uh, The Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy, Courage and all that stuff, I think it's playing again on a uh, modern day Cartoon Network. Um, if you have like cable or DirecTV, uh, I think they're airing it again, which is great. I love The Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. It's so funny. All the, all the, all the, all the classic, um, um, what do you call it? Uh, Cartoon Network stuff. It's great. I love it. Boomerang. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I used to watch that like super, super late at night. Remember that weird little, almost somewhat creepy um, commercial that they had where it was like all the little, little rolling bobbleheads and it was like do 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 Boomerang. Something, something only on Boomerang. Oh my god. I It would play at like, I think it would play from like 10 or 11 to like 4 a.m. It was kind of like Adult Swim, like watching the Adult Swim bumps when you were a kid. Um, Alright, I need to get my shit together and actually start doing stuff. Why are you stockpiling raw meat over there? I wanted raw meat over here! Yes. Animal carcass. And raw food. Yes, everything. Everything should be over here. The animals can get to it outside. Why are you idiots putting it over there? Yeah, the power of curls. F in the chat for my Cartoon Network boys who had to go so long without some good quality. No, I hate the fact that children these days are subject to these stupid, stupid ass shows. Like, 
dumbass. Oh, Toonami. Oh, my God. I made a LinkedIn post once where I was like, God, what I wouldn't have, wouldn't have given... What I would have given to be have been a voice actor for Toonami in its prime. Oh, my God. Just... A missed opportunity. I shouldn't have been five years old. I should have been voice acting already so I could be on on, on Toonami. But yeah, uh, the golden age of voice acting, dude, was my childhood. Um, for real. I wish I could have. I wish I, I, I wish I know we're all we're all created for the time that we live in. Like, you know, everybody's here for a time and a purpose. Um like on purpose right like we're all here to do a specific thing and live in a specific time but what i wouldn't give to go back and get to live during that time and like be a voice actor for all these amazing shows it, that, that's one thing that does break my heart as a voice actor that's not very big in the industry yet it's like i don't have the opportunity often to be in the stuff that i want to be in like, you know, I have had some really big opportunities come and go because I just didn't win the auditions. But man, like I would have loved to been in all the classic shows that I absolutely adore now. That's like my favorite series. Um, speaking of which, when I finally get like a TV and a couch, I'm still really like new to the apartment. So I don't have any real furniture other than like a bed and my, my gaming desk because I already had this. Um, but... I really want to get a TV and like just every week when I have like an off night, just eat some good food and sit down and watch like classic anime like Bebop and Trigun and Ghost in the Shell and all those other ones and like binge like classic Toonami stuff. I just feel like that would be really relaxing and really fun. Um, yes, I know my settle is an idol. I'm trying to get them to do things, but they don't want to do things. This is why I wish I had friends, dude. Because I'd love to do, like, anime nights with people. Like, actually have people over and, like, cook for them and watch anime together and, and talk and stuff. That would be really fun. But I do everything by myself. But I don't know. Maybe one day. Maybe one day I'll have friends who have the same interests and we'll, we'll get together and do stuff. But, alright. What should I be doing here? I shouldn't be beating around the bush. Okay. So, we need clay. We don't- we don't have any clay, do we? Hmm, okay, I feel like the smoke- mm, excuse me. I feel like the smokehouse should most definitely not be where the animals can get it. So, we'll put it right here, behind the fencing. Right by our- our meat butchery. Oh my god, I've been streaming for almost two hours already. I can feel it. My neck starts to kind of hurt after about two hours. We didn't reach our goal though. I wanted three I wanted ten people, but we only have three people joined so far. I just wanted I just wanted, you know I wanted to to, to make a goal. <laughs> the membership thing? Uh are you talking like for YouTube? Like the not subscriber thing, but like the where you get access to all the emojis and the early early stuff. Um I did. Oh, thank you so much. Ah, oh, thank you so much, Wolf. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> the membership thing, you have to, like, go to my YouTube page. Actually, I don't... I can't remember. Let me, let me go on my phone and look. If you go to my page and then you hit it, there should be an option uh vertical live streaming okay thank you youtube i didn't know that was a thing um i guess it's different on mobile yeah um if you oh yes the video is funny it's distracting for <laughs> um uh steph if you go to my channel on desktop at least um if you, uh, I think you have to go to a, one of my videos and then under my name, either like under, above, or right next to it, it's close to it, there'll be like a little, a little button, I think, and it says like join. 
It's either like join, become a part of, memberships, something like that, and it'll give you the option. Um, basic membership is 99 cents uh, so that you guys get all the basic access to like emojis and all that other stuff. Um, and the other one I think was like $5, which you get all that basic stuff. And then you also get, um, what's the word early access to like other videos that I do. So, uh, I only have two right now because I don't have much. I would really like to do it to where, when I do reach 5k, if people do want merch, I want to do like a, like a thank you shirt, <laughs> like an exclusive thank you shirt and make it like a limited edition. I just think that would be, that would be really fun. Um, so what do I need to design for merch? I need the dirt shirt. No, no, the dirt pants, the dirt jeans, and I'll cover them in dirt too. It'll be kind of like those vintage Abercrombie and Fitch kind of things. Like, were you, you know what I mean? Like, you know how it would be like uh, vintage distressed $200. <laughs> $200 jeans and they'll say dirt in cursive uh, embroidery on the butt like in the butthole too like it'll it'll like shrink into the into the crook of of the butt seam like you can't even really read it like people will have to like put their face right up to your ass to be able to read it and be like what the hell does this say and it says dirt like get, like your peasantry is showing <laughs> Any any person of culture would know that it says dirt, honey. <laughs> but oh, thank you for becoming a member. I appreciate you, member of the doghouse. That's the that was the that was the ninety nine cent one, right? Yeah, sorry, I can't even remember what I named my own damn levels. But um, yeah, no, it's like we'll, we'll make the so we we'll make the dirt pants. It'll have they'll be distressed. Like the dungeon, like if you wore them to a dungeon with the word dirt seamed in, in embroidery into the ass crack. And then we'll have, um, what was the other thing we were going to put on a shirt? What was it? Um, oh, hang on. Let me, let me scroll back in my, ah, oh, I can't scroll. Let me scroll back in my chat. While I scroll in my chat, I don't click out of my game because I don't want it to, to crash. So every time I scroll in my chat, it scrolls closer. What did, what did we talk about? What did we talk about? Oh, there was something that we said was gonna go on a shirt. Void Merchant. Was that it? Void Merchant on the shirt. <laughs> so we'll have a Void Merchant shirt and a dirt jean. Now all I need to do is come up with like, like a, a purse or like a bag for the gentleman. And shoes. What? <laughs> There's a pair of shoes I saw on Shein, by the way. The Chinese manufacturing just makes it so funny. But there's there's a pair of shoes I saw on Shein, and they're really cool. They're like these uh, old classic DC like skater shoes looking shoes, and they're like a iridescent purplish gold almost. Like they're really cool looking, and they're like high tops, and I really want them. And I think like on the side it just says like "good job" or something like that, or like like. I don't know, something like broken English, right? But it's so funny. A satchel. Yeah, a satchel. Which I am not really a purse girl. I like I like uh, satchels and shoulder bags. So hell yeah, we'll do a satchel that just says dirt. Dirt gang. Sheepdog dirt gang. <laughs> dirt member. <laughs> so what do we got here? Oh, right. We were going to smoke. And mm, we need clay. We need clay. Where... Where doth one get clay? Ooh, we got wolves. Wolves and goats and wolves and goats and wolves and goats and wolves and goats. What is this? Sticks. Mmm. Sticks. Uh, <laughs> wolves and goats and wolves and goats and is this clay? No, it's dirt. Wolves and goats and wolves and dirts and wolves and goats and what is that? That is a boar? We definitely don't want that. Yes! Yes! You know how Belle Delphine did like the bathwater thing? I'll do like a sheepdog dirt thing. I don't know what I'll do with the dirt, but I'll figure it out, I guess. There's bunny rabbits in the game too! Oh my god, there's bunny rabbits. That's a big ass rabbit, by the way. <laughs> what gamer dirt? Oh, okay, hang on. I made myself cringe with that one. That sounds disgusting. <laughs> It's like gamer girl bathwater. <laughs> Wait a minute, sheepdog, Belle Delphine, uh, collab, where I sell you my, 
my gamer dirt and you rub it all over <laughs> and then you buy Belle Delphine's bath water to wash it off with <laughs> I'm not as pretty as Del Del Delphine but I guess we'll make it work <laughs> Be gamer dirt bath water and it comes in the satchel like a package deal. You know how like bed bed bath and not bed bath and beyond. Um Bath and Body Works. Bath you know how Bath and Body Works will sell you like the little specialized bags of things? It'll be like that. Like it's in a it's in a satchel. <laughs> the gamer the gamer girl satchel. Limited edition. Endorsed by Gucci. <laughs> and and Louis Vuitton like, endorsed by big names like Gucci, Louis Vuitton, YSL, and many more. <laughs> And then like you get like um like G Fuel. I'll get I'll get a brand deal with G Fuel and it'll be like new sheepdog flavor dirt. <laughs> mm. The guy drinks it and it's like stained on his like on his stash like like chocolate milk and he's like mmm gamer dirt <laughs> I love dirt <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I need to shut up. I'm so stupid. I'm sorry. <laughs> Versace. Versace Sheepdog Collection. Mmm. <laughs> dirt. <laughs> the, the, most luxur the most luxurious dirt you've <laughs> ever seen. <laughs> Come get y'all limestone. I thought it was clay. Does oh, do the mountains not have clay? Ooh, that's not good. Boy, I sure hope we don't get attacked by wolves when we go outside. Can you lads and lady, if you don't mind? Look, oh my god, this is why I want the food in the in the house. The wolves are eating the meat. Cartha, uh, 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 Cartha, do your job as the big hunter brother and kill this wolf. Or I guess we could tame it. Yeah, just scare it off. As long as it doesn't keep eating all our freaking food. <laughs> oh, we had a pleasant conversation and decided to be friends. That's basically how my friendships go. We have one good conversation and then we're friends for the rest of our days. <laughs> Can I get all of you guys to like hunt that boar? I'm really, I'm really, I'm actually quite concerned about that because if you guys don't know... Boars are actually really, really dangerous animals. What are those? <gasps> nuggets! Gotta get me my nuggies. What is this? Oh, is it like a ore deposit? Is that what I'm looking at? Gotta get my nuggies. Ooh, nuggies. I love nuggies. Put the nuggos in my mouth. I love nuggies. Okay, I'm starting to get into like that streamer delusion. I'm going- I'm going crazy! The voices! The voices! <laughs> Where's the clay? I have all this limestone, but I don't have any clay. That's concerning. I would think there wouldn't be no clay. It's just a lot of limestone. You would think this is clay. It looks like clay. It's like... Red, right? POV, you're about to witness the start of the de-evolution of the wolf into the chihuahua. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> the wolf like looks at its paws one day after eating like really good from like human human leftovers and he looks at his paws and they're starting to shrink and he's like, "Hmm. That's a little weird." And then like <laughs> a year goes by and he notices that his paws have shrunk like 25% and he's like, "Oh god." Oh god! Oh god, no, it's happening! <laughs> and then before you know it, he just turns into a, a chihuahua. <laughs> Where's all the clay? I did not think about the consequences of my actions. Oh, I was like, what is that? What is that? It's just a goat laying on its side. Goats don't usually go horizontal, uh, from what I understand, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> okay. Even the big maps don't feel super, super big. Like, is it just me? This feels kind of tiny still. Hmm. I guess there's no clay. 
So we are going to have to go mining. However, that is done. Look at how cute little house. I love my little house. Oh my god, guys. Guess what I listened to the other night? Um, I was trying to find ways to make people click on my thumbnails more and get click conversion. And guess what came up in the YouTube search? Get some boobs in the thumbnail, bitch. Get your money up really fucking quick. Get some boobs in the thumbnail, bitch. <laughs> oh, man, I haven't heard it in so long, so I kind of forgot the lyrics, but, like... <laughs> did, uh, what, but 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 I'm a but I'm a boy. I don't want implants. <laughs> you should consider getting implants. You should consider getting implants. Everybody, you should consider getting implants. You should consider getting implants. But 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 I'm a boy. I don't want implants. Will it still look good though? <laughs> Get some boobs in the thumbnail, bitch. Get your money up really fucking quick. Get some boobs in the thumbnail, bitch. Boobs. 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 That's why the last faith has boobs in the thumbnail. <laughs> I was like, well, I guess I'm gonna have to start putting boobs in my thumbnail. So I did. <laughs> okay, how do I mine? I need to stop beating around the bush and actually do something. Okay, cabbage, raw meat, simple healing kit, ale, leather goat. I mean, goat leather, leather goat. Goats are made of skin, leather. <laughs> Ale, hay, limestone, sticks, wood, chronicles, mechanical. Where the hell did I get this? Birch sapling, oak sapling, pine, tallow. Okay. Um. How do I? How do I mine? Cause uh, th 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 I almost said Kahara. Kartha. Kartha has. Kartha has mining experience. My, mining. Oh, I thought he did. I need to set their schedule, by the way. I haven't been doing this right. Okay, so... At, uh, for all of you, starting at 5 a.m., you will all work until 1 o'clock. And then you can take a break for three hours. And then you'll work two more hours just just to keep up. And then you can do whatever the hell you want uh, in this time. And then you'll sleep one- I wasn't done! I wasn't done reading! Ospern, a tailored shapish. Can I come inside? There are these bars that I want to- a uh, bards? <laughs> bards that I want to avoid. Wearied by weird- by weird- <laughs> I'm sorry. This sounds like a Dungeons and Dragons kind of moment. Feared by wordplay and loot practice, Osburn gave the performers a bad review. <laughs> I just wanted a wee bit of peace and quiet, he explained, but you can't Osburn entry. It may come at the price. Yeah, sure. But we're gonna get attacked by bards, though. Oh man, they really beat you up. Look at this guy, he's wibbling and wobbling all over the place. Osburn, Osburn, you're bleak and blood like 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 a Hail Mary fountain at the Catholic Church. Look at you go! <laughs> I've, I've never seen a man bleed so much and and wobble so fast. <laughs> Look at this man go! Oh, he's losing health. But damn, dude, what are these do? They looted you really hard. My god, okay, um, you're also gonna work the same schedule. I don't care if you're injured, get to work! <laughs> okay, um, ooh, we're gonna need another... <laughs> I'm Irish Catholic, what the hell else am I supposed to say? <laughs> um, as for an I, th I, we're gonna need another bed for you. Oh! Prepare your settlers the bear simreg simreg sim simreg kimreg the beards are on the way uh and they're coming with their archers and two marauders um why 
Now, maybe it's none of my business, but why do bards need to have so much combat experience? Maybe it's none of my business. I'm just, I'm just curious. <laughs> um, okay, so we're getting a little um, POV the man. <laughs> yes, Fenala, Fenala, go and tend his wounds. Managers when you just lost a limb. POV McDonald's when you lose a finger, <laughs> and they say, oh, "That's too bad." <laughs> God, my brain is shutting down. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dude, all this bandwidth I spent this last two hours to double stream so I can get more subscribers and everything, and nobody has watched on Twitch. Everybody is from YouTube. <laughs> Why do I even bother? I, no, I bother to multi-stream because I want to get as many... Uh, my main thing right now is getting subscribers and viewers and, and all that good stuff, but uh, yeah. You know what, uh, Osbern, you can have Garth's bed for right now, just because you're injured. I'll have you go heal. heal. Have a sleep, but go there. Yeah, there you go. Lay that pretty little bolt head of yours down and have a rest. <laughs> POV me after a long day of bleeding into the food. <laughs> Why is my food not stockpiling right? Why, uh, the wolves are gonna come get it! Speaking of which, while I'm here on stream... Wait, what are you doing? Are you- wait, are you doing what I want you to do? Are you putting things where they go? I is she- did she do that? You should focus on consistency. Wait, with what? I'm sorry. Oh, oh, streaming, sorry. Yeah. Um, well, I would, really. I would if um if I had the freaking time. The Timmy's dad. <laughs> the Timmy's dad meme where it's like here's where I would put my time to stream if I had any. <laughs> because really I half the time I don't. Like I'm I work a 40 plus hour a week job and then I have my first job on top of that which is legend which you guys should go download by the way and give it a good review to help us out so that we can actually get funding and get get better stuff to make the actual app better um you guys should go do that um but yeah I most definitely like like I want to be able to make my living off of YouTube and streaming and my comic books and and legend and, and all that stuff um we're just not there yet so that's why I don't. But, um, like I was saying in my, um, which I don't think, yeah, I guess that episode didn't come out yet, uh, but in my last Faith playthrough, it's either episode four or two, two, three, two, three or four that I've recorded up to, I can't remember, but, um, yeah, like, I was saying I would be a soul streamer <laughs> if I, if I could, that would be really fun. Legend, so Steph, Legend is, um, Legend HQ, actually, is a, um, an app that I work for. We do like audio comics and uh, yeah. So we do audio comics and we're running a promotion right now actually for a future title called Underground by J.R. DeBard. And it's about MMA. It's amazing. The art is so good and the story is really good. Um, yeah. So we're trying to get people to download because like that's like the main thing we need. So if we get a bunch of downloads, we could finally get investors to give us their money finally. And we can start putting actual like like details and 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 fun stuff into the comics and whatnot and we can make the comics better so yeah that is legend hq i want to see if this actually works no don't run away don't run away there's two wolves inside me and one of them wants to be friends with you don't run away little wolf come here come be a part of our family we can offer you meat we could offer you uh, domestication. I promise it won't be that bad. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I can only do it once a day. Okay, well, all right. Did I mute my phone? I was about to say, I feel like people have not been bothering me as much as they usually do. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. It's because... <laughs> it's definitely because I had my phone muted. But it's because people constantly bother me. Actually, somebody sent me a message about something that I'm selling that I need to ref that I need to reply to. 
real quick. One second. Dude, of course, the day I don't go to work. The day I don't go to work. They put out a candy, cookie, fruit, and brownie table? I'm going K KMS. I'm going to KMS. I'm going to KMS. I'm so tired. Why do I always miss the good stuff? It's not fair. <laughs> it's not fair. <laughs> I want Easter candy. I haven't had a chocolate bunny in years, bro. Okay. Whatever. It's not like I wanted candy. It's not like I need it. <laughs> but it's not like I, it's not like I want it. Whatever. Whatever. Freaking whatever. 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 I don't even want candy. I don't even want candy. Get this wolf out of my meat. I like how he can shoot. Kartha is so badass. Look at him shooting through the window. That's my big brother right there. Oh, we got wolf. We got wolf. We got wolf. We're eating wolf tonight, boys. If only we had clay. <laughs> we could smoke the meat. Make it last a little bit longer. Yes, I know. I know what that does. I just want... Let me freaking go mine. Okay, overview. I am demanding my I am actually... Like, for somebody who loves statistic and, like, colony building games, I am so bad at reading statistics. Like, so bad with numbers. It's not even funny. Where... Do I have to unlock? Oh. We probably need tools to do it. We probably need tools to do it. Okay, how much is cartography? 30? Damn. Damn. Um, how do I research to? I probably need, yeah. So, mm. That's odd, though. Right? Because if, if, clay making is right after architecture then I should be able to make tools in the first round of like upgrades right did I am I stupid did I not this is for bows though tools tools mm, tools mm -hmm. bows and tools that's why mm-hmm <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can't see it because I don't have my face cam on today, but I'm tapping my head. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what I was missing. <laughs> uh, kind of surprised YouTube didn't send me a congratulations email to be like, congratulations, you got your first member. Because YouTube likes to bother me with everything else. <laughs> Don't bother me with everything except the stuff that actually matters. But yeah, um, who said that, Steph? Right, um, as far as, like, consistency, I completely wholeheartedly agree. So the funny thing is, I started consistently posting Fear and Hunger, um, about a year ago. Or so. Maybe a little over a year, something like that. And, um, oh, that's right, they're coming in a day. Um, <laughs> Um, and I noticed, my, like, my subs went from, like, I went from, like, 20 subs to, like, a thousand something in the course of, like, a month. It was insane. Like, I thought I was, I thought I was just gonna blow up, which I didn't, um, but got a lot of people all at once, and they all came in, all for the Fear and Hunger community, and, um, I went through some stuff where, like, I just couldn't really do YouTube the way that I wanted to, which the way I want to is still not even how I'm doing it now. Like, I want to be able to do it every day. Like I said, I want to make a, a career out of it, like the, the big gamers and the big producers and stuff. Um, but this is better than what I've been doing because I've seen growth again. So what I'm trying to say is I did it consistently and I got a lot of good, a lot of growth. And then for a while, I lived with my parents again because um, I wasn't making any money. Like, no matter how hard I tried, I just could not bring a single dollar in. And I couldn't do YouTube because people were just always talking, always yelling. There was always background noise. It was just really distracting. And I have performance anxiety, like, when it comes to performing on the mic, um, voiceover and uh, <laughs> YouTube. Like, I just don't... Um, I don't like people hearing me, like, outside. It just feels cringy and, like... um. 
I don't know, like people just don't really get streaming sometimes. So, um, and yeah, it just made it hard to perform well because I was so nervous about being like heard and, and all that other stuff. So, but yeah, um, so when I moved here, uh, I had privacy, you know, I'm not surrounded by my family or anything. I have the occasional person who walks by my apartment and I'm like, whatever, but I don't half the time. I don't see these people face to face anyway. I don't even know who lives here. Like, so, but yeah, um, ever since I started posting consistently, like at least once a day again with Blasphemous and then The Last Faith and, and all that stuff, I've been getting like maybe one, like one at the least five at the most subscribers a day again so that's great um yeah the consistency is most definitely a big thing um i met someone locally recently who's also a youtuber and he doesn't have a lot of subscribers like he has under 100 and he's got great content um it's just like i told him like i don't know i guess it's just personality and consistency like that's how i grew i mean i know it sounds like super 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 generic but that's all i got that's all I got for you, bud. That's that's my that's my advice. Like, just be a really likable person. Engage with your community. Um, be kind and humble and consistent. And, you know, hopefully it goes well. Thank you, Wolf. I really appreciate that. Genuinely. I genuinely, genuinely appreciate it. Well, so, Steph, that's kind of what I'm trying to say. Like, I work full-time, two jobs, and then YouTube. You know, YouTube takes a long time. Like, like to produce content, um, like I'm, I planned to stream today for, like I said, between two and four hours because I actually want to give people time to come and enjoy the stream. And then I'll probably edit this down to, um, you know, like, uh, like make a video out of it just to capitalize on the amount of time I spent playing this today. Um, but like, that's, that's a lot of time, dude. And, uh, working 40 hours a week plus between two jobs. And then having to come sit and talk to people for another four or five hours just to build your numbers. Um, I played um, a Chilla's art game today that I'm going to release soon. And the game took me an hour to beat. And it took me maybe two or three hours to edit because I went through the initial editing run, which was an hour because the game took an hour. And then I spent about another hour or two editing because I wanted to make sure I had like everything properly cropped and clipped and, and all that good stuff. Um, so yeah, it's just, it takes a lot of time. And like, I'm not saying streaming is a hard job at all. I would do anything to be able to wake up in the morning and just stream and make hundreds of thousands of dollars like some of these guys do, right? But like, it pisses me off actually, really. It really pisses me off when some of these entitled streamers are like, you should give me money because this is my job. Like, no, dude, this is your job because people give you money. It, it, it's not you. Like, your income is totally dependent on the people who grace you with their generosity, right? Um, and I would love to do this full time. I just don't have enough people, uh, like, income, like, contributing. So it's just not feasible right now. So, you know, obviously I have to go work at a normal job. But... Yeah, no, streaming is not hard at all. If anybody tells you that streaming's hard, they're entitled and they're lazy because this is not hard. I'm having a ton of fun. Um, but it is kind of like, it's not like stressful or hard. It's just, it wears down on you because you sit for a long time. Um, you know, you, you want to stay talking the whole time because you want to engage with your people and, and keep people engaged with you. But um, I don't know if you can hear it, but my voice is kind of starting to strain too. Like <clears throat> talking for two hours straight, it's it's hard on your throat. It really is. Um, but yeah, no, it's not hard. It's just um, you have to have endurance. I guess <laughs> I guess is what I'm trying to say. Uh, what if you posted the full length vods? One channel unwatchable does that separate from his usual posting, although he splits. His content between what 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 is a this is probably a stupid question but what is a vod like a vod what is that is is that just something I don't understand because I've seen the term I just don't actually know what that is yet yeah, no I have water I'm just saying there's muscles in your throat and just like if you did 
bicep curls for four hours straight, your muscles would get tired in your arms. It's the same thing in your throat. Speaking of which, though, thank you for reminding me to drink water. I didn't even realize how thirsty I was. Um, Alright, let's make these tools. But you said I could make tools! I didn't want bows! I wanted tools! We need tools so that I could go mining! Am I not- am I dumb? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, ship dogs brains are turning. Um, I don't know what it stands for, but when I see people who post- So it's like, it's just- it's, it's basically just unedited streams, then? Is that what you're talking about? Because, I mean, I- I- I let it, um... What's the word? I let it, uh, process on YouTube. And then, like, I just let it, you know, um... Like, you can go back and watch the streams on my live tab, or whatever it is. Um, I used to record, uh, for me to, like, have it in a- in, on my hard drive, too. But... I don't have the hard drive space anymore. Like, I just don't have enough um, storage memory for that. So, I don't do that anymore. I kind of just take streams as they are and capitalize off of it for what it is. And then, after that, I kind of just have to have to let it go. Um, and you guys can watch the full unedited version on the YouTube and the Twitch. Uh, whatever it's called. Like, where it records it in the server and then, like, it processes it and it, it leaves it available for watching. But I don't personally, like, record on my OBS as well and then also post um, because it's, you know, uh, it's just too much for right now for the computer I have and it, I don't have enough memory. Give me one second, guys. It might stutter. I need to hit something. It was actually recording this whole time on my OBS, which I didn't mean for it to. That's gonna be a huge file. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to go delete that. But yeah, so... <sighs> oh, sorry, my throat's really tired. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have some, uh, warm either miso or tomato soup when I finish to kind of get my throat a little break and a little bit of relaxation. <clears throat> but yeah. So yeah. Uh, yeah. I just try to- my philosophy is just stay humble and, you know, actually act. <laughs> Not act. I mean, like, if you really want to do it, you don't have to act like you want to do it. But, you know, like, act like you want to be there. Like, no, which I don't understand why you would if you didn't want to stream. But nobody wants to watch a stream where the streamer is, like, annoyed with the people watching. Because <laughs> the whole point of streaming is to have people watch and, and entertain people. Like, I mean, I guess, yeah, you could just stream... Uh, for no reason, but that would be kind of dumb. I'm just taking up resources and time for no reason. But, yeah, no, you stream to talk to people. You stream to to do stuff, you know what I mean? Like, like with people. That's the whole point of YouTube for me, is, like, experiencing stuff and documenting it so I can go back and, and watch it in the future and look back on fond memories of new games that I played and then also um, for other people to, ha to in have enjoyment and entertainment. Um, okay, so there is a Discord, but the link has been, um, non-functioning for a really long time. And the reason why is because we had an incident... Well, we had one incident where somebody really racist came in and was causing a lot of trouble. And it rubbed me the wrong way and kind of turned me off from wanting new people in the good community that I had. It just made me really nervous. And, um, also, I kept getting a lot of creeps, like, pop in and out, and they would say creepy-ass things, and, you know, with online stuff, you have to be careful, and I it just really rubbed me the wrong way and stressed me out unnecessarily. So... I cut the entry point to the Discord off, and it's kind of just been a really close-knit, closed community. I might open it back up, but I still need to do research on how to, like, age restrict. Because I really don't want anybody under, um, 21 in there. Just because we're all adults, um, and so adult topics do come up a lot. And I would just much rather, like, 
like like fully mature people be there like not even 18 year olds like i want like 20 and 20 21 and up in my server because there's nothing like explicit in my server like we don't post pornographic stuff we don't talk sexually explicit things it's just we're all adults and i just feel more comfortable only having adults in a majority adult space <laughs> right so yeah, it's and then like it's a matter of setting those parameters so that only they can get in uh, adults, and then also just the fact that like uh, I don't know how to do that, and I just have peace with the Discord server, and everybody else has peace with the Discord server. So yeah, I don't know. I I want to open it up and I want new people to come in, but. I don't want to disturb the peace. You know what I mean? Or I don't want to open it up for someone else to come disturb the peace um yeah i mean if you could uh maybe leave it in a comment on my latest video leave me maybe like step-by-step -step instructions on how to set an age limit and uh you know just make it safer for everybody and, and make sure that it's only adults in there um yeah it's to protect it's to protect the kids like underage people and it's also to protect the peace of the adults in there um and also just so that we all are on the same mental wavelength right <laughs> so well what, what, what were we doing right we were getting iron and i guess did you guys actually go get the iron i get so distracted when i talk that I forget to pay attention to what I'm actually doing. Um, let's see. So a dumping stockpile is where waste is stored. A designated area where weapons and armor. We don't need that right now, per se. Um, oh, we do. Oh, actually, we'd cut, we, we need weapons. We don't need a stockpile, though. Can you go make yourself a spear, Osborne? Because you are the reason that they're coming here. <laughs> Wait, what? Garth? Okay. Um, I'm just- I'm imagining we have to get iron. So that we can make, uh, pickaxes or something. Something to actually get the, um, what do you call it? Clay. To, to actually mine the clay. Wait, a clay brace here. Yeah, it's made of clay. It doesn't make clay. <laughs> it doesn't fire clay. Um, weapons rack, a shelf. Where is the leisure? No, I don't want leisure. I want... Ugh, warfare. No. Cabbage field. I just unlocked it. What? Well, where did... Stonemason. There we go. This is gonna have to go on the outside. We'll just have to start expanding. Maybe I'll make Osborn. Let's make Osborn his own house. If he lives. If he lives, that's his reward. <laughs> we'll build him a house. And he'll he'll be our personal stonemason. We'll have him do that kind of work. We'll make like a little medieval suburb. <laughs> we have like a little house here, a little house here. Okay, so Osborne is going to have another spear. He's going to have a spear. My bad. You need to get up out of bed. You've been sleeping all this time. You're, you're fine. You're not even still injured. Go pick up the spear. No, get it. Get it. Go get that. You need to work, sir. You better work, bitch. <laughs> you better work. 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 You better work, bitch. Work. 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 Work, work Osborne. Work. 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 Go get this shit. Come on. Go get that iron. We're gonna need it soon anyway. Oh my god, look at that lag. Ah, ah. Okay, so what can we make here? Limestone bricks. How the hell do I get clay? 
How do I get clay? There's no way to get the clay. Dirt and clay are two different things. You can't make clay out of dirt. Hang on. I'm asking Google. Hmm. In rocky soil. Oh. Come on, where is it? Clay can be found in rocky soil. Not much, but it's still something. Also, by the way, if you need braziers, smelting furnaces, kilns, you don't have enough clay, click the building in the shop in the side menu and select the option to build it out of limestone. No, but I want clay! <laughs> Oh, we're friends! And the search party comes in six hours. Dirt blocks are nice, but I no, I need the clay for other things. Marky soil is in the clay. The face of clay. No clay on a mountain map. Dude. Okay, so I think we have to buy clay from the merchant. Um, that's great. <laughs> That's great. <sighs> okay. Alright, well. Let's go chop this tree, I guess, or something. I don't know. We can't we can't get clay. So I'll have to find a different way to get clay. I don't know. I guess, well, I Okay, let's take care of this pressing issue, um, and then we'll go from there. We have a big house. This house is a little bit bigger than I thought it was. Like, it looks small from the inside, but from the outside, it actually looks pretty big. So, if we... If I make bricks... We have limestone. Can we start making houses out of them? Where's the... Copy paste. I do like the copy paste system that they have. It makes everything much easier. Resource wildlife item. Food materials. Raw materials, sticks, uh, 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 this is not what I'm... Wait, we have a short sword? We have a sword? We should probably use that instead. Where Where is it? It said it's in my default stockpile. Is that not our original default stockpile? Am I going crazy? Oh, the boar sleeping. Such a cute, slumbering little murder machine. <laughs> Wait, why would you put the books outside? Why would you do that? <laughs> why would you? There it is. I feel like I want... Um... I'm pretty sure Kartha... I'm pretty sure Kartha has... Melee. Oh, he has super high melee. Yeah. Come get this bread, boy. Put that in your pocket. <laughs> Why do you not have the sword already, bro? Oh man. Getting a little warm in here. Hmm. I still don't know how to plant these damn beet seeds. They're gonna decompose! Okay, select... Person... No... Why, why can I only do... Certain things... With certain items... But not others? Did you just put that raw meat in your mouth? Okay, well, if you're unhappy... Yeah, don't blame me! I didn't tell you to do that! 
I sure didn't tell you to do that. <laughs> oh, they're coming, aren't they? Oh, they're coming. Oh god, they're coming. Okay. Uh, everybody? Don't panic! <laughs> that, 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 uh, that, the office meme. Oh my god, it's happening! It's happening! <laughs> it's happening! I want to see inside the house. There we go. I guess there's nothing we can do except wait. And I really wanted this. Oh, but I'm impatient and I keep not not letting them research enough. We should probably do that though. Cuz partnering Yeah, no. I need like I need clay. Ugh. What does dirt do? Oh! That's horrifying! Why do the bards look like that? <laughs> the bard began to tell an achingly beautiful saga of broken promises. A fugitive in oath. Hair flowing. Eyes closed. His finger ran over a small harp. The ethereal music sweetening the enchantment. You would, you would let Osburn come away, would you not? Spellbound, nonetheless, you had to choose. Wait. Oh, it, oh, it gives... Okay. Your settlers get a positive mood modifier for helping someone in need. Uh, I guess we're fighting. Okay. Negative 102. That's great. We now have sworn enemies, I guess. <laughs> okay, I know how to fight. Um, Because this happened. Like I said, it was between like day 7 to 9 or so. All right, everybody, get your weapons out. Where are they? Are they here? Are they coming this way? Void Marauders. <laughs> First we have Void Merchant, and now we have Void Marauders. Where are they? Oh, never mind. This map is really big. Damn. That's not, I didn't think it was this big. <laughs> Come on, guys. We have four- it's four of us against three of them. We can do this. Not enough beds. Oh, I'm not- I'm not concerned about that. Thank you, though. Come on, guys. Here. Charge! <laughs> okay, whoever's got bows, get them ready. Fire and aim. Oh wait, no one's got a bow. Oh, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. No one's got a bow. Oh, he does, Garth does, Garth, Garth still does, okay. Gang up on him! <laughs> Don't let him get up! <laughs> Don't let him get up! That is creepy. Oh my God, please don't kill Kartha. He's like my favorite one. <laughs> The beleaguered settlers came under attack in the spring of 1353. Their ordeal continued for an hour, and that took two hours? All you did was slap shields. Mercifully, all settlers survived in the end. Two sworn enemies died in the fight. Karth of Wolf was the bravest settler, dealing the most blows, and he took the most damage. That's it. That's my Kartha. No. No survivors. Take him out. Don't let him retreat. Yeah, <laughs> go wobble after her. Don't let her get away. <laughs> We're all just bleeding. Oh my god, look at her bleed. Oh my goodness. Kartha, I don't want you to die. Please don't run too far. You are bleeding. Where's your health? Where's your health? There we go. Oh, he dislocated his shoulder. Okay, Kartha, stand down. Stand down. Stand down. Stand down. Go back home. Go back home. Go lay in the bed. No, go go lie lie in your bed. Yeah, go lie in your bed. Uh, where is everybody else? Okay. I don't want- Sorry, guys. I completely forgot that I was streaming. I thought Kartha was gonna die. Oh, God. Okay. Th did she get away? You guys let her get away? Well, good news for Osborne. Uh, he gets to 
Did he live? Did he live? Did he live? Yeah, he lived. Okay, I was about to say. Oh, he's got a concussion, though. That's not good. Um, you don't lay down. You definitely don't. Um, Fenala, you're gonna go take care of your brother. And Garth. Um, he bruised his nose and his arm. He's fine. He's fine. He's fine. Okay, so congratulations to Osborne. You get a house. The price is right. You get a house. <laughs> That's not what I asked for. That's not what I asked for. I want you to chop trees. We are rolling into summer soon. High temperature, high temp temperatures, <laughs> high temperatures, chance of heat waves, build underground storage to keep your food. I have no idea how I'm supposed to do that. Um, also guys, I think I'm going to cap it at three hours because my voice is starting to go and my throat's starting to like really clench up. So I'm probably hitting my, my limit. So I think we'll, we'll cut this at around three hours. I might release that video today. I was kind of saving it for a rainy day, but I'm also, it's kind of, it's not trending or anything. But I wanted to release it, so I might. All I have to do is hit publish. Oh, I need to make a thumbnail for it, I think. Ah, I can't remember. God, that's another <laughs> that's another thing that takes a lot of time is thumbnails and making them actually decent and all that other good stuff. Uh, Osborne is... Everybody, you, you guys can chill the hell out. Go, 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 yeah, go chop trees. Fanala, what are you doing? What are you doing? You you don't you don't need to do that. Okay, there you go. Go go do your thing. <laughs> go do chores. Where did Garth go? Garth is bleeding. Garth is bleeding. Oh no. Oh crap. I accidentally clicked out of my I went too far in one direction. Garth, where are you? Garth? You are bleeding. Um, I did not realize that. Fenala, can you come help your brother? And then, Garth, you can stand down. Thank you, valiant soldier. You've done everything you can. Yeah, there you go. Go wobble. Go wobble over somewhere. <laughs> I don't know what this means. Stomach. How well th their stomach is. Oh, okay. Oh, so it's like, like straight up health. Like, uh, tummy aches and everything. Cool. I didn't know that we could get tummy aches in this game. 10 out of 10 game. What was that one? <laughs> in Fear and Hunger, you can have, uh, butt bleeding. And worms. <laughs> and I remember I was so disgusted with that too. I was like, ew, we can get worms in this game. <laughs> Never seen it to where we can get worms in a game. Mm, we should build a shelf. If that actually does anything. Why are they not stockpiling the food in the house? I'll, I don't know. Seeds, trophies, books, medicines, waste, far, far, fermenting ingredients. Food. Yeah. Like I have everything. Stimulants. Oh. You mean depressants. <laughs> Alcohol is a depressant. Not a stimulant. Um... Yeah, I, I mean, we've got carcass here. I'm confused as to why it's not... Maybe I should clear it and try again. So, carcasses, food, and we'll say fermenting ingredients as well. Why not? Because it, it has to do with food. I just don't understand why it's not... Because all this is just going to waste and being eaten by animals. How do I transfer? Can I transfer? Crap. Like, like, take this and then click over here, maybe? No? Why does it not... Hmm. That's annoying. That is quite annoying. But yeah, I've... Uh, so the reason I jumped on this game is because I saw a bunch of people playing it on, a. Uh, on YouTube, and it looked really interesting. I think Splattercat played it. I'm not sure. 
I can't remember the first person who I saw play, but it looked interesting, so I decided to just try it out. And I like it. It's actually really fun. I played for a couple hours earlier today, too, like right when I woke up. Um, and that's what made me want to decide to, to stream it. Ivy Shrub. Gives me sticks. Okay. Um, we need to get started on building Osburn's house. So I'm going to kind of go aerial here so I can see the grid. I don't want to build too much, though, because I want to add on to our house. But hit the... I guess we can add backwards. Maybe I can make, like, a hallway. And, like, make a, make a back bedroom. Like, two back bedrooms. Just, like, a hallway that goes around and then two back bedrooms. And this will be, like, the... We can make this, like, a kitchen or something when we have interior decorating <laughs> research. Um... So this, we'll, we'll do like three walls here, extra wall for buffer space, we'll give him a door, so we'll do four walls on each side, and we'll give him his own little shack basically. He can put a bed and, and other stuff he needs there. And that will be that. That boar coming so close makes me nervous. Nice house. Thanks! I built it myself with my brothers. <laughs> we built it ourselves with my brothers. I, I like how I jump between their Russian, Norwegian, Swedish, Irish, Scottish, all in like one week. <laughs> it's like, where do you guys hail from? Uh, everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> who's working on what I can never tell who's doing what you guys kind of just run all over everywhere all the time Garth are you going to die why are you still bleeding is that a is that a bug I really hope that's just a bug is your nose bleeding like what's wrong I don't under why do you have a bleeding effect I don't understand Ew, I can hear the flies. That's gross. Okay, Kartha is- is he unconscious? Convalescing. What does that mean? I don't know what it means. His birthday is the 10th of winter. Interesting, I didn't know that. Yeah, I'd probably put him as a winter baby. Let's see. Okay, let's get serious for a second. <laughs> Can I see his... I guess I can't see his, um... I can't see his, his faith alignment. Because I had him pretty devout. Um... But I guess because I didn't build... Yeah, I didn't build the thing. Um... Oh, cool. I didn't realize that those were, like, modifiers. Um... I guess because I didn't build a shrine, he didn't. He didn't, uh... <laughs> Where do they hail from? Yes. <laughs> do you, those children. Where do they hail from? Yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> like, I, I can imagine, like, Kartha. Kartha is, like, hanging out at a tavern somewhere. And a cute girl comes up to him and she's like, Never seen someone like you from around here. Uh, where do you where do you come from? And he's just like, uh, yes. No, like what? What's what's a handsome lad like you doing here? You're not local, are you? No. <laughs> Where's that accent from? It's 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 so charming. Uh, everywhere. <laughs> So Garth is bleeding, but what? Wait, did Fenala not freaking help him? Go help your brother before he dies. We can't lose your brother. First of all, we can't lose him because he's one of our original, original, original settlers. That's what I was trying to say. Um, and also, we just can't lose people. Like we need people. <laughs> 
How are we supposed to build a legacy if we let all of our siblings die? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, guys. I don't want to stop streaming. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. Excuse me. I'm having so much fun. I'm just tired. And it's almost 8 p.m. And I really should get to sleep because I have to go see my family early tomorrow for Easter. And then after that, I have to make sure I'm ready to go back to work early in the morning on Monday. So... I do need to go lie down as well. My eyes hurt. I'm not going to lie. After a while, after staring at the computer screen for like straight for so long, like the, you start feeling like bags under your eyes start forming. I do need to go take a break and like eat something and go take a bath or shower or whatever and then go to bed. So I think we'll cap this at about 7.34, 10 minutes from now. That sounds good to me. We got six people, though. That's good. That's more than what we usually retain. Uh, I did want to reach at least ten, but it's all good. I just don't want to stop playing, either. Like, <laughs> like I said, this game is actually really fun. What was that? Annoyed. Sounds like a you problem. I'm trying to get us situated. And y'all just want to complain. <laughs> Garth, why do you run like that? What is on your feet? Hang on. Sir. Oh, his clothes are... Oh, I was gonna say, it looks like his clothes were, uh... Torn a bit. Osborne, you're not even building your own house, you lazy son of a bitch. Come here. <laughs> are you still hurt? Is that why? Oh, he has a concussion. Sir, you should not be sleeping. <laughs> you should not be sleeping. <laughs> well, go get some sleep, baby girl. Why are you running around and not sleeping? What time is it? It's 21 hours. So, 21. Yeah, just whatever. Go get some sleep. You guys deserved it. You defended the colony. That's all I can ask for is that you don't die. What is this? Ooh, whoa, what is that? A two-handed mace? A great helm. Summer clothes. And... Wait, a stag head and a, a helm. Okay, um... I don't really need you guys. Is I don't think I can make anything out of you. I Can we make stuff out of human bones and skin? Like, is that... Is that something we can do? Is, this, is there something... Um, what's the word? Productive we can make out of it? I don't know. Maybe like books or something. I don't know. Hmm. That's... Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, they... They, mm, they used to do that and we don't... Let's let's not let's not reenact history. Um uh Kartha, are you okay? Your shoulder's still dislocated for two more days. And he's just bruised everywhere else. You've got a concussion. She's fine. She didn't even really fight, which is funny because she's like the most frail member of the tribe that we have. Um He's fine. He's just bruised. Good. I just wanted to make sure. Let's speed time up a little bit because... Let's see. Is this, like, priority? Is this why I'm having people randomly go do a bunch of different things? Let's see. Don't hmm me. <laughs> it was just a thought. I just don't like wasting resources. Where? Oh, that is the priority. Oh my god, I should have known. Like, I knew there was a way to do it. I just didn't know that there was, like, an actual... Oh, increase all. Okay, so... I see. Okay, so... This must be, like, what they're good at. Okay, so, yeah. Mm. Oh, go. Oh, Karth is good at research because he's more intelligent than Garth. I'm sure that's why. 
priority, lowest priority. Um, put this at a three, but I do want Garth because he can probably maybe like he can probably um what's the word? Yeah, the word escapes me. Multitask manager, whatever the hell I was trying to say. Osborne, I want kind of a less. What does that mean? I forget. I've heard the word. I just don't remember what it means. Cut plants, cook, craft, carpentry. Where's construction? Okay. Osborne, I want, yeah, I want that number one on your list. For you, I want it maybe at a number three and you also a number three. Patient, tend, urgent, haul, grow, and harvest. Animal husbandry. Digging and mining areas marked. Is that what that is? It's just picking these up mining? Am I misunderstanding like the actual implication of the word mining in this game? Um, cut plants, cooking, tailoring, artist. I didn't even know these were options. Interesting. And we still don't have any research. Why is nobody researching? Garth. Yes. There we go. Oh, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to make 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 you up. I didn't mean to wake you up for from sleeping. I just wanted you to actually go contribute to the colony. <laughs> what time is it? Twenty. Uh, oh, oh, it's three a.m. I'm sorry. That's my bad. Uh, you were gonna get up in an hour or so anyway. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> We need it though. We really need it. We really do. Ramps and soil. Wait, what? Okay, interesting. Uh, defensive, right? Cartography. Don't, don't, don't spend it on anything else. I can't make a smelting furnace if I don't have any clay. Do I have to build a merchant shack? Like, is that the only way I'm gonna get? Osborne, please get up, bro. How much longer does this concussion last? 94 hours. I was gonna say, like, yeah, I know you can get up and work. I've seen them do it. Go finish building your own damn house. <laughs> I don't like that. Why did you guys do that? Why did you build it like that? I want an extra wall. If you're gonna, if you're gonna four-corner it, then fully four-corner four it. Don't just randomly leave it. Yeah, this means that, like, we don't have the resources, which is incredible to me, because we had a ton of wood earlier. Does it only register if it's in the stockpile? Garth, if you're so damn unhappy, then go freaking sleep. God, just... Ugh. Go. Fine. Sleep. <laughs> I don't want to hear your complaining. What are you unhappy about? Is it because we have no food? Okay, that's understandable. It's probably because you let all the freaking meat go bad because you didn't bring it into the house. We have ale, though. Not like that works, but... <laughs> would you guys do one thing at a time? That's, that's my only thing. I wish they would just do one thing at a freaking time. All right, we are coming up on three hours. I think I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. So thank you everybody who joined the stream. Very happy to have you. I'm gonna go ahead and go take care of myself. And I might stream again tomorrow. I may not. Um, depends on how busy I am needing to like do basic self-care stuff and preparing for work on Monday. And then also, um, it is Easter, so I don't, imagine anybody will be on they'll probably be hanging out with their families so thank you guys so much for attending the stream i'm the silent sheepdog i will see you guys in another stream bye guys